One. What's up, shitters? All right. Uh, today, on considering unalive, we're gonna be making Hungarian goulash, 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 whichever you want to call it, and uh, a delicious mushroom appetizer, and uh, some fantastic chocolate banana bread for dessert. Uh, but first off, welcome everyone. Let me put my onions away. Everyone's having a good day. You can still see me. Uh, we have to start with a P.O. box opening. Because uh -oh. Wasmec, oh, also the producer's here. Everyone say hi to producer. Hello. Uh, we're, we went back to the little lab mics. Am I on? Yeah. Yeah. On. Uh, just because the shotgun works great, but not for just two people. But we're going to start with a P.O. box opening. And uh, go from there. I was instructed not to touch this until stream started so it is it says perfect customs i'm a little concerned i'm a little concerned too it comes in a very nice little baggie though should i should i wait for should i wait for more people before we look at this uh it says we have a couple but i haven't seen anybody in chat just yet oh, those rat bastards you silent motherfuckers you know what no that waits until we chop some onion also, we're drinking this time because I'm an adult. You did what? Rum and Coke? Yeah. yeah you got a yingling, it. I got a rum and Coke. If I chop the onions now, you one won't be here to fucking judge me. So, so we're just going to start. And I'm going to leave the onions in pretty big chunks, Nelson, because I know you don't like them. So, uh, just pick them out. Woo -doo 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 -doo. 
How's everyone's hair going? You having a good time? Yep, my dad's on. Hey, <laughs> he says hi. Eric, buddy. So, reason I picked Hungarian goulash. Also, well, well, everybody asked for me to make borscht, but I don't know how to make borscht. I've never had borscht, and I feel like it would be very rude of me to be like, oh, I'm this random fucker. I'm going to cook. Someone's being invaded. I'm going to cook their national dish. No, I feel like that'd just be an insult. So, um, an insult. So instead, I am going to cook one of my favorite dishes. Throw all the fingers in so Ewan doesn't get mad at me. <laughs> uh... Goulash, which my mom makes all the time. She makes a little bit more of an Americanized one. But the one we're making today is pretty authentic. Uh, a lot of authentic goulashes call for stuff like uh, Cerulliac, which I'm not a huge fan of. It's very woody. But this one, we're going to be doing something pretty basic. Onion, beef. Not goulash without beef. Uh... And then we're gonna go with a simple, uh, some bell peppers. So I got some bell peppers in the in the fridge. We'll get those out, chop those up. These are the nastiest fucking onions. I bought a bag of onions and I regret everything. <laughs> uh, Kislo uh, Maslow twelve says, "Dude, hey Brambar, <laughs> who's that? That is the uh, the Ukrainian that was gonna interview." Did his interview, did great, and then right before training, Putin found out that the Ukrainian was going to join a NATO unit, like us, <laughs> and invaded. So, uh, I don't mean to blame Kislo, but very strange timing there, my Ukrainian friend. <laughs> you should have uh, hidden your application and been like, oh, this is the, it's an all, all, it's all uh, Russian unit. Pretty sure Sherm's got some fucking... <laughs> footage of us doing Russian shit. Ugh, fuck. But anyway, yeah. What's up, everybody? I did I did shill a little harder this time. I put it, instead of lifestyle, I put it in uh, the general chat of the third. And then I posted in Tom's Discord, and then I posted in my Discord. So it was kind of... We're going for maximum petty today, boys. Maximum petty. Mm -hmm. Jasper. What? Jasper just had lunch or dinner. He eats it at five every day, so he he's he's nice and plump. So he'll sit back there for a while. He'll lick himself clean like he should, like we all wish we could. <laughs> you have an automatic feeder for him, and you could hear the motor starting to whir. Well, so the creepy thing about that feeder is is you can pre-record a message like you know, hey, Jasper, dinner is ready, but I didn't. <laughs> so. But the first time you set it up, you have to record something, so it's just silence. So all you hear is like audio feedback from me hitting the button. So it's like, click, click, click. and then you hear the motor start going, and mm -hmm. he hears the click, click going. So it doesn't matter what he's doing, where he's in the house, he is fucking gone the moment he hears that. He is all <laughs> over the fucking feeder. God, these onions are tiny. That's okay. How's everybody's week? Uh, Kislo, you don't have to answer that question. Because it's probably been shit. <laughs> Oy. But I found some authentic Hungarian, or certified authentic Hungarian paprika so we don't get, you know, firebombed. Because, much like with uh, a couple of the chefs I found out I watch online, uh, Europeans don't take changes to their food lightly. I watched one where a dude put he, he called it a paella, which is a very Spanish dish. Mm -hmm. And they were having like a rice battle. So they were having, you know, what can you do with different kinds of rice? So he put a paella into a burrito. And to be fair, he acted like a douche the whole time. He was like, paella, and that kind of crap. And he got death threats. The actual, like, um, <laughs> Spanish government came out and, like, denounced his recipe and shit. It was the, and he's proud of it, too. Really? Yeah, it's the funniest shit. They turned him into a pickle. It's funny shit I ever seen. <laughs> uh, I just need something to hold all my fucking onions. So. Get that going. Beef's already cut up. I bought two in beef, which is what you should get for a recipe like this. Um, we're not going for a 
super precise dice on this one. We're just going for cooked enough not to taste weird. So we'll get these chopped up. Hopefully Ewan's not here so I don't get fucking screamed at. Uh, Myth Rumbar's not feeling so hot today, so she's upstairs. So, you know. You're just stuck with uh, Rumbar and I. Yeah. And Tom's not here because Twitch threatened me if I brought him back on, we, our channel would get canceled. So. <laughs> Something about threatening a four year old. I tried to stand up for Tom, but apparently he said some real mean stuff to a four year old. And they just, <laughs> they don't allow that on Twitch. <laughs> Next time when someone insults me like that or calls me out, Nelson, do me a favor. Very clearly announce their name to me. Hey, I said this. Because I heard Scott <laughs> and then proceeded to lay into Scott. Yes. I'll make, I'll make a note of that for next time. Yeah. Or you're going to be like, hey, said this. And I'll be like, well, fuck them. And you're like, oh, by the way, is your mother. And I'm like. <laughs> and then she's just like, she'll kick, she'll kick the door in and beat the living snot out of me. Yeah. Oh, man. There's a giant hunk of onion still on this onion. Uh, tech guy says, Paprika is the Hungarian word for pepper, and Hungarian-style paprika is not smoked, but rather fairly sweet. Yes, it's also dried in the sun. It was the Turks who introduced the chilies to Hungary, and is a very popular spice in Hungarian cuisine, giving distinctive flavor to soups and stews such as chicken pap... Uh, paprikash? Chicken paprikash, yeah. And beef goulash. Uh, chicken paprikash is, uh, for the nerds out there, what Vision kicked, cooked for, uh, whatever her name is, um, in the Avengers movie. I can't remember her name. For the life of me. I'm a huge nerd. I can't remember her fucking name. <laughs> uh, the Scarlet Witch. He cooked oh, you're right. Uh, chicken paprikash for her to lift her spirits after they all become war criminals. Because that really helps. Um, but we're just... You know, we're just, it's, a, it's a quiet stream today. Like I said last week, last week was more about hanging out with people. Uh, I've exhausted all of my friends. It's just him and the other guy. So we're back to the quiet cooking hour for three hours of Brumbar. Will says, uh, take a bite out of the onion. Make sure it's fresh. Seeing as my eyes are quite watery, I can assure you that these, uh, these onions are quite fresh, Will, but thank you for the, thank you for the tip. Um, <laughs> another note for the guys who are giving me shit, uh, I have separated the audio channels for music and, uh, the sub sounds or like the notification sounds. So the notification, notification sound should be a lot clearer now to hear in case Andrew wants to donate a bunch of money. So we're going to, oh my God, my eyes, dude. <laughs> my eyes. Jackson says, hi. What's up, Action Jackson? We're gonna put some onions in a bowl. Actually, I don't even need to do that because I need to put the onions in the fucking pot. So, where phone? Where drink? Here phone, here drink. Drink time. Mm-hmm. Melt pork lard or butter. I just get my options on it. JD asks, where's the fire extinguisher? Oh yeah. So Everyone. Do you want to take the GoPro down there? No, I'll, I'll pull it up. Everyone, thank tech guy in chat for purchasing us a fire extinguisher <laughs> and a wall mount. I'm not going to wall mount it because that's weird. But everybody thank tech guy for the very nice fire extinguisher. You could mount it on the inside of your cabinet there if you needed. Where? The inside of your cabinet that you've got? Uh, well, all my cabinets are full of shit. And he also bought us a first aid kit. I have, I own several trauma kits, but thank you for the first aid kit. I never said I needed a first aid kit, but whatever. Tell me when Wazmek shows up, if Wazmek comments, and then we'll open his gift. I'm looking for him. Um, so we need three tablespoons of butter. Oh my God. I really, I fuck myself. These other two recipes mean because I was not paying attention. There's no butter in that one? Oh, 55 grams of butter. I wonder how much how many grams are in a stick of butter? Uh I do not. 
That's not good. And the stuffed mushrooms require two tablespoons. Okay, I got, I have four sticks in total, so I should be fine. Okay. Damon says, yo. Damon, that'd be Grayson. Grayson, uh, simp number one right now. Much appreciated. Jackson says, health and safety. Health and safety is important, Jackson. You're very right. That's why I use my knife in the safest way possible. You and only cringes a little bit when I use it. All right. All right. I'm trying to keep up the energy, but it, it having a co-host really helps, and having you here really helps because I'd be talking to myself. Yeah, and that's not a good time for anybody. Being able to read the chat and everything. Yeah. Well, like you, you sit there and you like you, you try to read chat, but with how I have to do it, I have to have it over here, and I'm doing stuff over there, I'm doing stuff over here, and it's just it never works out. Right? Yeah. Put our butter over here in front of GoPro cam. So if Nelson ever cuts to it, it's just a stick of butter in its face. <laughs> it's just in the corner of it. Mm -hmm. Do you have them on kitchen cam? Or do you have them on B cam? Yep. Boy. Everything you ever want in a cooking stream. You both see me, my toned buttocks, and the pot. <laughs> We're really... I, why did I get the bowl out? I'm not even using it. Will wants to know what's in the mason jar. Uh, what's in the mason jar is just rum and coke. Uh, it's mostly rum, but it's technically a rum and coke. All right. So we're melting our butter. We can do pork lard, but it's kind of hard to find pork lard. Uh, Dutch oven. Sweet. Uh, medium high heat and cook the onions until they begin to brown. So we got to saute up some onions once this butter is melted. Kislo Maslow says, Brumpar's got a really big fridge. It's even bigger. Your guess is as good as mine. I think he's saying I have cake or a rumpus. <laughs> I think that's what Kislo's saying, is I have an ass. Which I appreciate. Thank you, Kislo. New follower, Resting Zeus. Thank you, Zeus. Uh, I'm sorry if that Vine sound effect is super fucking loud. For some reason, I can't get the volume of that one to turn around, so it's really aggressive. He says, Shalom. Shalom, brother. Before I get in trouble, not Jewish, but totally cool with it. That sounds worse. How did that sound worse? <laughs> How does, I'm cool with the Jews. That does, mm, I'm going to stop talking. Um, anyways, so I could start cutting up shit while we're waiting for those to steer off. I'm a, I'm a Neanderthal. I'll use my thumb in the pot. We'll all be okay. I washed my hands a couple weeks ago. <laughs> we're getting our butter going. I keep forgetting I need to level up my, my oven. So like whenever I get something going, it uh, all of it pulls down to the edge closest to me. <laughs> I see. Yeah, we can I'm see really. That. It's a really high quality kitchen we're in, boys. This little Maslow says, I think that Brumbar can hide inside that fridge. Ah, uh, there's a lot of shit in here currently. Speaking of which, bell peppers. Uh, and tomatoes. I've n okay, here's the fun part. Never in my life, because I don't like them raw, have I ever cut up a tomato. So this one's going to be fun. Oh, nice. I hear butter burning. I hear butter. I smell butter burning. Resting Zoo says, if you're cooking for yourself, there's no problem with being handsy. Well, I'm cooking for me and my wife, who has no reason to complain, uh, but also Nilsen. But then again, there's a Taco Bell like a minute from here. So if no, the camera doesn't change for a little while and you just hear me talking to myself for a bit, it's because Nilsson wanted a chalupa. Will says he's going to poison the captain. Why? <laughs> uh, I don't I don't drink Captain Morgan, if that's what that's referring to. No, I think he's talking about me. Oh, that's right, because you're, you're a copy 10 I now. I am the captain now. That's right. It made Grayson so happy to say that Arthur traded his T for an L. He took that L. That, that, that one had him in fits yesterday. He was so happy about that one. But we'll get our onions going. And while these are going, we'll get our beef that's doing. Or, 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 sorry. We'll get our shit chopped up. Hi, Jasper. You don't want to be on a tower anymore. So we'll get those going. In a nice heat. Let them reduce a little bit. Try to break up some onion clumps. Uh, Nelson, if you don't want to eat this because it's full of onions, I'll completely understand. It is perfectly fine. We all have things we don't like. I don't like beans. 
And I also don't like uh, eggs in most circumstances, Will. So, suck on that. Racing Sue says, you've never cut a tomato? Yeah, I've never, because I don't eat them. I don't uh, normally eat tomatoes. I'm not a huge fan of them. So I just don't eat them. And Kiesel Maslow says, Taco Bell exists in real life? Yes, it does. <laughs> and it's fucking delicious. I like putting the inflection on everyone's questions. After the win, I need to try it. After the win, is that what he said? Yeah. Hell yeah, brother. Will says he agrees with the beans. Also, don't come after my way of life like that. I don't understand how you can love eggs so fucking much. I mean, I, 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 there's nothing wrong with eggs. I just, they're kind of bland. So, I'll eat them in, I love them in a good, uh, in, a, in a good uh, fried rice. I love eggs and fried rice. It's just when they're by themselves, I find them very bland. Nelson, how my onions look now that you, now that I got you have a camera on it. I don't yeah, have to constantly check it. So, well, we can see. Um, let's see here. They they look pretty much exactly the same as when you left. <laughs> okay, well, let's go check on them now. Up, oh, I'm getting a little fond on the bottom of the pot. That's what we're looking for. Let these simmer till about 524, 525, and then we'll throw the beef in. JD says, how long is the goulash got to simmer for? Got to simmer for, I think, 45 minutes, and then you throw in the patats and the, and the carrots, and then you simmer for another 45. So it's going to simmer about an hour and a half, and that gives us time to make and bake our bonanza bread and get our uh, mushrooms going. So... Resting Zoo says, uh, you're cooking them wrong if they're bland. And uh, Engineer says, uh, not using red onion? Uh, no, you're not, you don't, you're not supposed to, I don't think you're supposed to stew with red onion. Red onion is great on uh, like barbecue chicken and stuff. But from what I've seen, you don't want to really saute or boil red onion. It makes it really bitter. <laughs> My dad's putting egg suggestions in there. Devil, deviled eggs. Fuck deviled eggs. They're Hard disgusting. It's just eggs. mayo and, and mayonnaise. Or mayo, mayo and mustard. Scrambled eggs and quiche. Ah, uh, Elise loves quiche. I'm not a huge fan of them. What's the weirdest thing is, I'm not a huge fan of eggs. You know what I fucking love? Carbonara, which is just egg yolk pasta. Pretty much. But it's so good. I think it's just the whites I don't like. Let's see. Well, that um, sounds mildly racist. Uh, it's It's the egg whites I don't like. Grayson says, unsurprising that Will likes something bland like eggs. Uh, he also says, also at work, can't type like normal. What do you say? Uh, it's Grayson says, is at work. Ah. Can't type like normal. Engineer says, it explains a lot. What does that mean? Good. <laughs> you might have to explain yourself a little bit on that. It explains a lot. You talk a lot for a man who could be taken out by an errant skittle. <laughs> It's all fun and games until Inger shows up to one of these summers, like, fucking yoked out of his mind. And I was like, for every time you've insulted me, I'm going to beat you. He says, about the onion. And wow. <laughs> about the what? He says, it was about the onion. And wow. Mm. Turn our heat down a little bit. We're getting a little dark edges on our onions. <laughs> Chitty says, every camera cut, Jasper is closer to the food. Hi, buddy. He's a good boy. So our eggs are... Our eggs. See, now they're stuck in my head. Our onions are getting a little brown on them. That's nice. We'll give those another hot second before we throw them the, the beef. And today we're being... Our beef... Is the camera still on? Yeah. This one? Mm -hmm. Okay, the preview window turned off. No, it's good. You're still on. Uh, we're using stewing beef brought to you by Publix because it's the first package I found. So we're going to give those another minute while we... Prepare our yellow onion, or onion, fuck, our yellow pepper. I've been watching way too much Josh Wiseman, man. You can't call it onion anymore, it's onion. I gotta do some whiskey business later. Mm-hmm. Kilo Masho says, if I'll be alive to that moment, this will be my main purpose in a future visit of the USA. Taco Bell? I think so. That's what's up. Uh, we, we joke, but uh, when Savo, a professionally trained... French chef from the Netherlands came to the United States to hang out with us. Would you guys like to guess what his first meal was? 
It was, in fact, Wendy's. He wanted a Baconator. So we got Wendy's, a Baconator, a large fry, and a Frosty. And that was Savo's first meal in the United States. And that, that, that tickles me every fucking time. So our onions have a little bit of brown. We got a lovely fond on the bottom of the pot. See, I watch, I watch Babish. I know what a fucking fond is. We're gonna throw our beef in. So we're doing uh, both beef chunks and beef stock. So this should be a very beefy beef stew. So we're just gonna <laughs> take off the beef diaper. Nah, keep it in. Extra yeah, flavor. It's there for flavor. <laughs> That's what keeps all the juices inside. <laughs> <laughs> let's get this beef broken up yeah engineer agrees he says leave the plastic it's just a flavor saver something wrong with you people so this serves four so I think it's a, it's a very there's enough beef so it's a pound and a half of beef so it's not like that you don't you're not going to have a lot but you're going to have huge chunks of potato a lot of veggies in there so I know it looks like a lot of onions and shit, but you know, beef's expensive, and this meal is meant to fill a lot of a lot of tummies at once. So it's going to be a lot of filler. So we got those going. I need to get my tomatoes chopped, I believe. Because the next thing I got to add in is those go for seven to ten minutes. So right at five thirty. Oh, bro, we get that going. Yeah, we'll have goulash done like seven ten. It's yeah. perfect. Add the bell peppers, tomatoes, and garlic. So I gotta, I gotta do five heads of, or five heads. Good God, that would be the most garlicky thing, no, no, man, no. We gotta do five cloves of garlic, and I'm gonna cheat. Where's Wozmac at, man? I don't know. I haven't seen him yet. Someone at Wozmac. He wanted me. He wanted to watch me open this fucking package, and I want to open it without him. It's either a uh, another chef's gown. If it's a chef's jacket, I'll be impressed if it fits, because I'm thick. <laughs> uh, Did he, get, he, he sized you up? Yeah. Don't forget the camera adds 10 pounds. No, my meals add 10 pounds is what happens. <laughs> That's going. Chop up some tomatoes. Get our beef in here, our beefy beef, the beefiest beef known to beef. Try to get some beef on the bottom so it develops a little fond on its own. I love stewed uh, onions, man. I know you hate them, but I love them. It's all good. I've wiped off my board so it's not so pepper juicy. All right. Do you cut the core out of a tomato? You know? I hope this fits. <laughs> Cleaf so. I'm gonna need a bigger bowl. Chad, is this too loud? Sorry. Sorry, chat. Um <laughs> Okay. I'm not a huge fan of dick cam. There you go. No, you got your tomatoes covering up. Hey, this looks swollen to you guys. <laughs> that looks like a good tomato, but who the fuck knows? So we're going to cut out the stems at least. Because I know you cut out the stems. Yeah. It is so fucking windy outside. I had to take our, uh, we have a wind chime. I had to take it down because it got so loud at night that it, it, it would wake me up at like 2 a.m. I was like, our neighbors <laughs> fucking kill us. These tomatoes look very meaty. They had like, they were called like steak chunk tomatoes or something. I was like, and I picked one up and it literally felt like I was like holding a rock. I was like, God damn. This tomato works out. <laughs> Those look good. I mean, they look like good tomatoes. I don't know what else to do with them. I'm just going to slice them again, and then we'll put a nice... I don't know if it says dice or chunked. 
Tomatoes diced. So, I'll put a pretty fine cut down on them. And we'll go from there. They do a nice cut right in front of the camera. Oh, yeah. There you go. I'll put my hands behind that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's nice. Right, give me one second while I stir my beef again. I'm running out of time, though, so I don't have time for my garlic. I got three minutes. Fuck, that smells good. Yeah, it does. All right. So we're going some pretty big chunks of tomato. Fuck it. My, my board's getting all mushy. <laughs> it's cool. I've seen those booze boards uh, everywhere. Yeah, they're like the number one recommended chopping board right now. I mean, they do great, but, you know, with, like, everything, they take a lot of maintenance to keep them from getting fucked up. And before anyone complains about chunk, my chunk sizing, I'm going to probably run my knife through this pile a couple of times to thin it up a little bit. Um, it just makes me happy that my knife, after all this time, is still sharp enough where I don't have to put any weight into this. Because isn't that, like, the... Uh, the major test for a knife is you have to... You just have to let it do its work. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think my biggest problem is I cut with the uh, the leading edge, and you one always gives me shit. It's like, cut with the fucking fat part of the knife. Where is you in? I haven't seen him on. He's either at work, or he's probably at the knob or something. But he was one of the boys who was demanding cooking streams, and now he's never here, so... Yeah, and I haven't seen Wasmack yet, either. It really be your homies, you know. <laughs> they demand it and look, oh no. Hope this is a good visual for the camera. It is actually. <laughs> I'm gonna cover it in fucking tomato juice. I'm gonna make that full screen. There you go. Got this up a little bit. Oh I'm so sorry, Scream, I touched you. My dad wants to know how how do you sharpen your knives? Uh, I do not sharpen them. I uh, I hone them with uh, with a honing stick, um, and then I think the I the idea is sometime this summer I'm gonna there's a company that's local that sharpens knives like professionally, and I'd rather them do it than me. It's kind of cool actually. So we got our beef a stewing. Onions have degraded. And then I'm gonna cheat on my garlic. You'll all see that here in a second. But we'll get our well, we have chopped now in there. So we'll get our tomatoes in there. I dropped a huge chunk of tomato. <laughs> oh, it's mostly juice, which is even better. Where's Jasper at? Uh, seeing as the leaf is upstairs, here. Jasper's probably. Oh, is he with you? No, he's by the uh, the window. You like his little tent? Yeah, I just saw that. Is that he's new? adorable, isn't he? <laughs> Does he actually use it? Uh, sometimes. I've seen him crawl in and out of it a couple of times. I okay. think he's still kind of on and off about it. Uh, but we'll get those in there. Up off the board. And then we're going to cheat with our garlic, and I'll show you how. Where's my garlic? Where's my garlic? How much time do I have to let these sit? You got 5.31 right now. Remove the pot from the heat. I add the bell peppers and garlic for another six to 10. All right, so I got, I got more time. Let's mix this in. It's colorful already. Look at this son of a bitch. <laughs> so ideally, we're just trying to get our caramel, our onions are starting to caramelize, so they're getting a nice soft brown. Beef's brown on the outside, or it's cooked on the outside a little bit, uh, but it'll cook through here when we're stewing. But right now, we're just trying to get our our veggies going. You! Get out. Out. Jasper's a gremlin. Get out of my kitchen, <laughs> you little shyster. 
My dad says you need a fridge cam. All right, Eric, you want to come buy me a fridge cam? I've bought you people everything, and you keep demanding more. What do you want from me? Fridge cam. That's what they want from you. So one, two, three, four. We'll get, we'll get some big clothes. I like I like garlic. We'll set our additional clothes aside. I bought two heads of garlic, thinking there's like oh, there's like four or five clothes in each one. <laughs> I'm retarded. We're gonna set all that aside. Clean up our cooking area. You smash them? Uh, no. Well, I, I do have a garlic crusher, courtesy of Wazmac, because you give it, you accidentally give a dude your fucking home address one time, and he just keeps buying you shit. <laughs> I mean, it was a really wholesome reason why he wanted it. He was like, oh, I want to buy you guys a yeah. uh, wedding present, and then it just got weird. Should you be like iDubs and have a P.O. box that people send stuff to? I would love to, but I don't think they love us that much. Are they just send us like random and weird shit. Oh my! I well, knowing JD, the first thing he's sending is a fucking like an Iowa Lego set. Uh, no, is <laughs> probably an electric can opener. Oh, because oh, yeah. fuck you guys! Oh, it's in the drawer that's blocked by the camera. Oh no! I bought another. I don't need it uh, right now, but I bought another can opener just for you clowns. But guess what? It's hand operated. And it literally looks like you could take it into war. It's got, instead of it just being like a little tab, it's like a full-on <laughs> <thing like that. laughs> So we got this going. This is a very veggie, veggie Oh, one. yeah, JD said electric can opener. <laughs> called it. <laughs> Fucking called it. And uh, that guy says, uh, try elephant garlic. It's like four cloves in one. Well, I'm going to use the old trick of just fucking... Get a microplane. You don't have to peel it because the action of peeling it will get rid of the skin, but let the meat through. I heard that. You got skin on it. It's fine. So we're just... Oh, no! Nothing is falling apart! Are there fingertips in there? <laughs> no, but they had of garlic's in there currently. <laughs> Probably should have not done this over it. That's one. Pull over here for this. So we got all that garlic on the bottom. Throw that in there. And we're just going to do that five times. You keep that camera away from me. I'm not touching it. You've made it penis cam, so penis cam it will stay. <laughs> I think that works pretty well. more fresh garlic in there the crazy thing is i have the little jar of like free minced garlic but i feel like the moment i use it is when ewan shows up and he's like you fucking dick <laughs> this smells so good already yeah it does smell really good Chat, how's your day going? Tell Nelson how your day how your day is going so he can tell me how your day is going. This is when your dad pops in and was like, oh, I bought a third boat today. <laughs> he's saying he's planting uh, tomatoes and peppers tomorrow. Nice. Yeah, we went to the uh, store and bought uh, a bunch of pollinator flowers. So... Stuff that the bees like. This is your dad or you? For us, we're gonna make the uh, balcony a, like a pollinator garden. Oh, that's cute. And planter boxes and stuff. That's very cute. Um, yeah, we have a planter box in the back of the the patio over there, but uh, it's not going so well because it's it's really it's like a really cheap planter box. Yeah, is the problem. Well, you've got actual wooden railings. We've got like a little a metal rail that's kind of hard to get uh, boxes onto. So we have to. Hey, the truth, I prefer the fucking metal one because the wooden one flexed the first time I put the box on it and scared the shit out of me. Hmm. Oh. 
No one wants garlic skin. All right. Five cloves of minced garlic. There you go. Woo! We're on a roll. <laughs> At least likes to hide the, the hot hands. So we got this going. Oh my god, this smells so fucking good. I haven't even seasoned it yet. We'll let this go for another minute with these uh with the garlic in there. Let it get its flavor going. Bring it down with a touch. And then uh Gigi says it already looks good. It does look good. It smells fucking fantastic. Um, remove the heat. Okay. Remove the pot from the heat and stir in paprika, salt, pepper, caraway. Could not find caraway, boys. I'm sorry. But mm. according to the article I read, caraway is not a super common ingredient in goulash. It's in, in some and not in others. So, sue me. So, what am I adding of each thing? Remove the pepper. Stir in the paprika, salt, pepper, caraway. So, no caraway. But we're going to throw in... Teaspoon of salt, half teaspoon of black pepper, and here's the fun one. A quarter cup. A quarter cup, Nilsen, of paprika. Oh my god. It's a lot of paprika. It is a fucking lot of paprika, but this is literally a paprika dish. So. Grayson says, he's at work, the life is suffering, but at least he's well caffeinated. All right. So we've let that simmer for a couple minutes. I'm going to move it off the heat per the instructions of the... Well, I've turned the heat off. I think that's fine enough. Yeah, yeah. Um. So, you know what? Who fucking wants to measure salt and pepper? We'll just salt this bitch manually. A couple of good grinds. I have it on a pretty fine grind, so it's not as much as you think. Throw some pep in there. I like pepper. Pepper's good. All right, and then paprika. We need a, a quarter, yeah. quarter cup of paprika, which is a terrifying thought. You got like a big opening? I'm going to need a big opening. <laughs> is there a quarter cup worth of paprika in there? I bought two of them. Oh. <laughs> Here we go. I like it. I was like, hey, this one's for the spoon, and then gives you the tiny fucking opening. Measure this out. God forbid I have too much paprika. Here you go, boys. There's a quarter cup of Hungarian paprika. <laughs> oh, that smells good. You're slow, pour slowly. Oh, yeah, there you go. Pour. <laughs> We'll get that stirred in here in a second. And then what? Uh, add the beef broth bay leaf, return to the stove, and to bring to a ball. Okay, so we'll get our glass. Diddy cookware. Said, gotta do the old cinnamon challenge with paprika. <laughs> that sounds awful. <laughs> so I'm gonna get this mixed in real quick. Is that hot? Kind of. Very, very hot. That's very hot. Don't touch that. Don't touch the pot. <laughs> So this paprika probably is going to soak up a lot of this the juice liquid. Everything's nice and soft for the boil. We're doing a potato and carrot goulash that's more traditional. I, I do love a, a pasta goulash, don't get me wrong. But uh, something about like stewed potatoes is just so good. My dad said, well, that's a lot of paprika. Are you sure you read that right? <laughs> Hi, everybody. A quarter cup of quality, genuine, imported Hungarian sweet paprika. I don't know how to read. Okay. I'm surprised the camera actually picked that up pretty well. I mean, it fucking better for how much I spent on it. So we're using a really high quality beef broth because, you know, you're, not, you're making stews. Don't. Keep out on your fucking broth. 
So we need someone added me in the group me. I had to dip out of the stream, started snowing like crazy up here, and I want to get to the gym. I just read that, too. What a, what a fucking quitter. Jenny says, are you sure that was quality imported genuine Hungarian? I'll show you the container, smartass. I don't know why I closed my phone. I need that. How many cups of broth, phone? Five cups of beef broth. We're currently at two and a half. <laughs> Will says not watching cooking streams at the gym. He's not gonna make it. He's not. You know, you really gotta. It's gotta tease yourself. <laughs> so how much are you putting in there? Five cups. A lot of broth. We'll make it. Sorry, did I hit you? Did I hit your stream? Sorry. Um, and I need a bay leaf. Belief. Where did I, where I put my beliefs? Fuck! Did I put? Join me. Join me in finding the bay leaves. Stream. Use the GoPro. What? Now, nah, because the moment I pick the GoPro up, I'm gonna fucking find it. Here, ASMR. Your mom's in the kitchen. She can't find her fucking ingredients, and she's about to snap. I know I have Bailey in here, Nixon. I'm not crazy. There they are. I found it. God, Bailey smells so good. <laughs> All right. We're going to take the juice. We're gonna mix together our this our our delicious soup. And then here in a minute, uh stream, I hate to tell you, but cook cam's gonna go away for a little bit because I have to cover this. I really uh, like having my cook cam. It is nice. Top. Bailey, return to the stem, bring to a boil. So we're gonna let that come to a boil. Shove the bay leaf in there. The reason you add the paprika at the end, right before you add the water, is paprika, if it burns, gets super fucking bitter. Mm -hmm. That's the problem with it. Oh, man, what am I doing? I've been neglecting my delicious yeah, beverage. Yeah. Chug. Please sponsor me, goslings. I buy so much of your fucking rum. <laughs> yeah, who wants to sponsor us? Yeah, sponsor, please. I know I don't deserve it, but sponsor, please. I'm going to go ahead and and chop up the carrots and the potato just so we can get that ready. But how do I want to do it? I don't own enough fucking shit. Last time I checked, potatoes won't turn brown or nothing if you cut them early, so. Yeah. Could be fun. So we got our handy dandy peeler. Come on, handy dandy potatoes. My dad wants to know, when do the potatoes go in? Well, the potatoes go in 40 minutes. So we're going to let that stew for 40. And then we're going to add the potatoes and the carrots for another 40. So it said two medium potatoes. Well, fuck that. I like potatoes. So I got two giant fucking potatoes. <laughs> so I'll get a little closer to you guys as I feel my potatoes. Where is this Wazmac man? I know, right? He talks all this trash. Can someone ping him? I mean, just ping him and he's probably... He might be at work. Yeah, it's possible. We'll see. I just don't want his... Uh... I'm going to open it here in a minute. The yeah, curiosity is getting to me. Sense. I want to know. Yeah, JD says he's a pilot now. He is a pilot now because uh, a slot opened. And him... Nikki technically asked first, but Nikki was a pilot before. Um, and I feel bad for him because he basically had to babysit Graham. Graham was a problem. Um, but I got to let the new guys come in first just so they get a chance at it. 
And then if anyone else ever ends up leaving or wanting to go somewhere else, because I know in your in your third, Captain, <laughs> um, <laughs> things are a little bit more loosey goosey in terms of placements. As long as you have someone to replace you, you can go where you want, which is fine. You know, we're all playing fucking Arma. Mm-hmm. Not really a game to be super serial in. Uh, Grayson says, Wasmex and Don at his new boss's stream. That's a bar. Yeah, Wasmex is going to be fucking th- uh, Valkyrie for the next year and a half because he don't show up to fucking stream. <laughs> he talks so much shit and then doesn't show up to stream. You got enough people for Valkyrie you can run in out of Little Birds instead of Blackhawks. I refuse. I hate those terrible little planes. I, 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 I don't know why you like Little Birds so much. They're so great. They're so much fun. They're like flying seizures. They're like little sports cars. I hate them. I hate them so much. <laughs> it's like flying a leaf. JD says, I have Patrick to replace me. I'll switch to the boat captain now. I mean, I'll get you. I'll, I'll spawn a boat every op. I don't care if I have to beach the motherfucker. If it keeps JD happy, I'm for it. Oh, there's Galloway. Galloway! Hi, guys. An hour late. And he wants to be a mod. <laughs> Isn't he a mod? I think he is. He's got the little crown. He is. I have my I have the potatoes in front of Cut Cam. Just for you. Sword. See now you gotta make one that's kitchen, stove top, and GoPro. You don't have enough you don't have enough scenes, no. Yeah, I know. So we're just gonna chunk these. He says uh, he's been setting up his op today. Oh, is he? In, uh, I thought it was that Saturday or Saturday was Davidson's days. Okay, he says you will be in lurk mode. I thought Saturdays were Davidson's days. Um, I need to look at the schedule. I don't remember who has Saturdays. It's normally Davidson because he threw a big hizzy fit when I started streaming. And maybe he just couldn't do it this Saturday, and so Galloway took it. Even though Galloway knew he had a prior engagement. Galloway. <laughs> but Galloway's a very good dude. He works hard, so I can't give him too much shit. The idea is that if we ever start making money, um, the first major stream purchase, because I've already bought everything we really need for us, is to get him... A better computer because he does he helps out with you know the, the discord he helps out with a lot of stuff so i want to help him out and i would offer one to you but i've seen your computer you're just fine fine. <laughs> so we're just chopping patats getting these ready yeah galloway just needs to announce the stream to the op folk galloway do it yeah oh galloway this is what you do so they load in and randomly during the op, you pop in as Zeus and you ask him about something that just happened on stream. And if they don't know the answer, you fucking lightning bolt them. <laughs> <laughs> That's how we win. Galloway says, I've uh, been so busy uh, recently, dude. It's crazy. Well, you are he the says, one. He says, yes, sir. He found a, he, he found a potential temp, uh, old uh, Roman temple site, so. I would see how he could be busy. So we're almost up to a boil. We're getting bubbles on the edges, but I want to. I want to. I want a burl. I want a good boil going. A good burl. But we're gonna put our potatoes aside. They. I don't think they'll brown. It should be fine. Put these in a dish. Uh oh. <laughs> you didn't see that. Oh, way. <laughs> that was my favorite piece of potato. Now we'll get these going, and then uh, hopefully by the time we're done chopping carrots, that's boiling, and we can start on our uh... penis enlargement. No, um, chocolate banana bread. Is it not boiling yet? It's Let's it's on it the edges, but it's not in the center yet. Oh no, she's starting to bubble. She's got a good bubble going. It looks so good already. It just looks like brown dirt water, but it smells so fucking good. 
I know brown dirt water doesn't sound appealing. <laughs> Your chef. But it smells really good. <laughs> oh, no. Grayson asked originally, he said, when can uh, JTEX get custom helmets like Pilot? So I told him it was uh, Barry's domain. He says, honestly, it's just memeing, but now you've given me a target. Thanks, Nelson. Honest to God, I mean, Barry, most things, it's, you just got to be nice and ask him. He'll help you with most shit. Yep. It's different going from like the pilot helmets because I, I did them for a couple of years well yeah you, you had a custom helmet for everyone yeah. above a certain pay grade which was great but it, it's exhausting to keep up with because there's so many like people movement little changes yeah you know. i'm gonna do four smaller carrots because i don't have like the big the big honkers i do hear the the pot a bubbling quite viciously oh yeah Who's, uh, Champ Malad says, make sure you put Galloway on Valk for the next two years. I have no idea who that is. Wait, who, what was the name? Champ. Champ? Champ Malad. I have no idea. All right. That's boiling. Nelson, turn off B-cam. Going away for a bit. Yep, that's all. Uh, then, uh, bring a ball, reduce the heat to cover, a uh, medium, cover, and simmer. Is that going to simmer on medium? I'm going to, we'll do medium, medium low. Uh, we're going to skim up our carrots here real quick and then throw them in with our potatoes and go from there. <laughs> uh, uh, Jack. Stay Jack open. Houghton. Houghton. Gosh, you guys pick your fucking names. Galloway sent me. Says, looks yummy. And then Will said, donate time to the server and I'll make a custom helmet. Wait, donate time to the what? Donate 10 to the server. And Jack is... Uh, I run Duffy. the fucking account. I don't think he was talking to you. No. Oh. And uh, Jack is Duffy. Very nice. Good to see you, Duffy. Duffy's just here for the feet. He's a little degenerate. <laughs> I don't think we've seen any feet tonight. Uh, probably in errant shots, but no, no direct. They haven't called for it. You know, you got to... I'm not gonna hear. I'm not gonna sit here and give you what you want unless you ask for it. He sent you a little purple heart. Well, boys, we're just gonna we're finishing up our prep for the goulash. This should be the last thing we do for the goulash. For it's just. Oh, okay, Google. Set a timer for 40 minutes. Sure, thank you. And that's starting now. Five minutes. If you need an alarm in the morning, I can do this too. Just say. Shut up. JD says, in retrospect, if you had just put last names and not rank slash fire team on each, I might have been a lot less updates. Yes, I agree. I was going uh, above and beyond since I was just in uh, college. And fucking fry hard. On. But uh, Duffy says, uh, just put them in the goulash when you're done. My feet in the goulash? I guess so. That's... That doesn't seem very sanitary. No, no, so what I gotta do is I need to buy a camera, mount it to the bottom of the cabinets over here, down by my feet, and then we just have a constant foot cam in the corner. Oh, no. <laughs> it's like connected to your shin. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. I think the goulash is the most like intensive part of this after it's just, you know, mixing shit. Shady says, I also don't think that floor garlic is sanitary. <laughs> what floor garlic? I threw that away. I think. <laughs> Duffy says, slowly turning into a Twitch water tub streamer girl. Hey, man. If you paid me, if you guys donated enough for me to buy a hot tub and clear it with my HOA, I'll spring for a hot tub. I don't give a shit. I just want money. I like the idea. Like I like cooking, and sometimes it cooks to just sit there and cook by yourself. So it's nice having people to talk to while you cook. Well, people to yell at you and harass you while you cook while you talk to you. <laughs> That's pretty much what it is. No. Hmm. Okay. What's your number? Um. Good. At least that's what it says. That lifts the average. And we both know your dad's watching through uh, U-tubs. 
All right. That's not a simmer. I'm going to lower that. I don't know what they mean by medium. They must be using the world's shittiest fucking thing. But we got our onions and carrots cut. We'll put that over there. Uh, yeah. Jake says he's excited for the uh, goulash. And uh, Grayson says he can help with the HOA. Some uh, light torture is good for the spirit. I don't know, man. The ladies that run our HOA are cruel. <laughs> They'd probably like berate you while you were torturing. Like, this isn't torture. This is this my kids from soccer practice is worse than this. <laughs> I don't need the peeler anymore. So we're into baking now. What are we making? We're making double chocolate banana bread. So first, we start with our bonanzas. Actually, first we preheat our oven. We're not going to use convection, because convection gets me in trouble. Is that what set off the smoke detectors last time? Uh, no, it's just because convection normally cooks stuff faster, so you get like a brown edge. So we need to, in a big mixing bowl, a big... See ya, Sorry. see ya, Duffy. What, Duffy's abandoning us now, too? He's gonna go escape Vietnam, apparently. You might need somewhere else, because now, now your whole GoPro cam is just bowl. <laughs> bowl. Hmm. There you go. You can point her down. There you go. How's that? Uh, let's see. That's not bad. I mean, the, the tripod's right there. True. I'm behind the center comp. No, picture. it looks good. It looks good. I shouldn't need this anymore. At least for a little bit. Are you simmering? Yeah. You simmer. I, I need a... How many, how many fucking ripe bananas? This is what bugs me. They say one and a half cups ripe bananas. Okay, 225 grams. That's what I'm talking about. Give me fucking grams, man. I don't like cups. Yeah, it's kind of a weird measurement. Does it still have the tripod mount attached to the bottom? Uh, it does. So oh. it's attached to it. You just got to hook it into that thing. I, I make things easy, baby. Um, you know what? Fuck it. I I want to know what's in the fucking bag. So while we're transitioning to uh baking hour with Brumbar. I'm opening the fucking bag. Yeah. Gotta here, yeah, stand. It feels like another. It feels like another rope. It's way too big to be a hat. I thought it was a hat, and I was gonna be fucked up. Cause I would love a chef's hat. What the fuck? What is that? Oh, so it's a. It is. It, it is a gown. Oh no. I'll feed all <laughs> you. <laughs> <laughs> I'll beat all you fuckers. <laughs> and then this, oh, there's another one. Oh, no. Let's see it. Let's see it. We can kind of see it, but not. I like my butt rubbed in my pork bowl, oh, baby. No. Those are fucking perfect. <laughs> when we do an outdoor stream and we actually grill, we're wearing these. I'm down. Those are fucking perfect. I wish I had somewhere in here I could hang them from, because that's fucking hilarious. You, you could put them up on your blinds there. You know? I'm sure the HOA would love that. It might help with the, the white balance in here. Yeah. See if you could, like, tuck them in there. So it's like, I look, it's a little clip on... Uh, well, the problem is, like, I... Eh, I could probably... <laughs> your HOA is going to love that. They can't see it. <laughs> I love that. That's perfect. I'm calling dibs on that one. That one's my favorite. I'll be all you fuckers. <laughs> so those are those are courtesy of Waz. Everybody say thank you, Waz. I don't know if you can see those in the background or not. No, you can definitely see them. <laughs> yeah, they're backlit, so you can read them even better. Yeah, you can. All right, so we need 100. Uh, we need... 225 grams of mashed banana, so I'm gonna throw some very soft banana in here. Oh fuck, I thought I'd need like four. 
that one banana is 150 fucking grams. So oh. part of me were like, oh, well, fuck. <laughs> you got four garlic, <laughs> four onions. Now you got four bananas. This one's got a skin. <laughs> fuck you. Now I got a bruise on it because I slammed it into the counter trying to catch it. <laughs> it's a soft fucking banana. 266. What is it supposed to be? 255. <laughs> 255 fucking even. Oh, that's a really soft one. Will says four food's fine. Jasper's got to eat. Do you want really soft banana? I am perfectly fine. fine. All right. So, add the right bananas and mash them to a pudding-like consistency. It's always a great way to describe stuff. Pudding-like consistency. I'll use my big fork. My, I'm a hungry boy. <laughs> yeah. Ow. Move that up there. <laughs> so we're just mashing our banana. Or uh, what most only people call, you know, nighttime. Yeah. And we'll... Uh... I'm just going to mash... doesn't look appealing at all i like i like the the quick breads the box banana breads yeah the ones where you just like you add egg and oil into it that's it but at least loves like homemade banana bread it does smell good though here's my question how the fuck does banana flavored anything not taste like actual banana <laughs> I think it's more of a texture thing as well. Banana yeah, well, like, like banana Laffy Taffy is a fucking joke. Well, Laffy Taffy in itself. They should call it close to banana. Yeah. I thought you were talking about Laffy Taffy in general. <laughs> no, no, just the flavoring. Yeah. I, I, yeah. Or cherry. And it's like just red. It's like, <laughs> it's like how What's the flavor of that? Red. Uh, add the melted butter, egg, vanilla extract, and Greek yogurt. So we need... 55 grams of butter, because God forbid I get an actual, like, tablespoon measurement. I have to go off of 55 grams of butter. So this is 76. So I ask for your opinion. Oh. Okay. <laughs> um, so, uh, six tablespoons is 76 grams of garlic. So I'm going to go down, I'm going to take two tablespoons off, and we're going to go, from, is it melted butter or regular butter? JD says, Fuck, uh, I got to move the kitchen cam, it's in the way of the microwave. JD says, uh, isn't that because a lot of banana flavorings are based on that extinct banana type? Probably. You nerd. Uh, I, need a, I need a ramekin. I didn't see that it was melted butter. And yeah, we can move your uh, camera rig around. I can move it, it's easy. Yeah. I'll take it off there. Well, that's my job. I'm the. All right, here. come on. Here we go. I, uh, so that was. Fuck. I'm manhandling the butter. I'm sorry, stream. Find you a homie who will mess with your camera rig for you. <laughs> I need six grams of butter. That's. We'll put it here for Just you. enough. Who the fuck cares? Once you go back to the goulash, then we I don't, will. I don't, the, the goulash just gets the stuff thrown in it, and that's it. Yeah, but we like to see it cook. It's got a pot top on it. You're not going to see shit. So how many eggs do I need? One egg. Now, I was betting on at least not eating all the eggs. And I was right. Oh, I'm so sorry, stream. I just keep hitting the camera. Or I keep hitting the fucking... I'm falling apart. Listen, they're making fun of us right now. You can't see it. <laughs> Stay. How should I desecrate this egg that to irritate um, Will? What's going on? We had a lot more reach last week. It's it. It you can go down farther. It just bites you. Yeah. I don't know why. So we need a egg. I really hope I didn't just like turn that butter into liquid hot magma. 
Right, well, it says six packs of eggs. One teaspoon of vanilla, everybody. Mm -hmm. One teaspoon. Oh my God. Hmm. It smells so good over here. Where's my vanilla? Will says, why would you ever need half a serving? What do you mean? Half a serving. Half a serving of what? Half a serving of what, Will? My patience for you? Bah. I just love that overhead angle. It's Being a good angle. To it. It's really All right, cool. we get it. It was your idea. You love it. Oh, I like it. Seated bastard. An egg. That shattered into so many pieces. I think I've lost my patience for eggs, and now I just destroy them. <laughs> Add melted butter, egg, vanilla extract, and Greek yogurt. I need Greek yogurt. How many? Half a cup of Greek yogurt. This is Elise's Greek yogurt. We're going to treat it with love and respect. <laughs> what? I'm just throwing your stuff around. You're not watching stream. You don't know what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh yeah. Now they can see my... Look at this motherfucker, dude. Look at it. Look at it with its fucking handle. You could rip into shit with this. <laughs> I could get into an Abrams tank with this. Um. <laughs> Here's a debate. Did your family ever get like... What was that? Oh, I think that camera just turned off. Um, I believe it did. I'll get back to it. See, that's that's my one problem with GoPros is they're finicky. They're like um, apple. Yeah, here's a debate. You know that like sour cream and chives dip. I know your family's not as white trash as mine, but you know that sour and cream cheese dip like you dip like ruffled chips yeah, into. Yeah. Do you mix it when you uh open it originally? Uh, yes. It depends on which which kind it is. Oh my! Is it is it being a bitch? Yeah, it it maybe it's overheated. I don't know, but it's it's just not one to work. So we're we're sticking with we're sticking with the good cam. That's fine. The GoPro's being a bitch. Um, one half cup Greek yogurt. Also, JD wants to know: Did you show your mama? Uh, I did, and the, she uh, loved it very much. I sent it to her directly. It went right after the stream. And she thought it was very cute. I, I, I am tempted to bring her on here. But I don't trust you people. Because one, I don't want to explain to my mother what brum bussy means. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see the aprons that he's got back there on the windows? Do you see what Waz got me behind me? <laughs> <laughs> They are perfect. That's amazing. You have to start wearing those exclusively. I like this man, this apron. I'll cook for all you fuck. <laughs> <laughs> all right. We get, I, I need some whiskey business. We've used our yogurt. Hi, Jasper. We need to whisk. We need to whisk. So we're whisking this shit together to a certain point. Oh, it's just well combined. Grayson wants to know, he says, uh, at Brimbar, my oh, boss says, uh, the you look like Hassan. Oh, like Hassan? Yeah. That communist bastard. <laughs> <laughs> Hassan's a huge uh, Twitch streamer and YouTuber. I don't actually, I don't know if he YouTubes. But he's I don't a, think I've ever heard of him. He, like, his whole, his whole channel's like, um, Soviet Union based. So it's like very communistic, very. Oh, mm. Not Soviet Union. I would just say communist based. Because I think he's he, like, he wears like the Che Guevara shirts and stuff. Not, I don't think he's a bad dude. But we all we all disagree on certain stuff. Yeah. I'd say that's welcome, mind. What do you think? It looks good. Oh my. <laughs> it's stuck it right in there. <laughs> Point of view. 
Your, your, your small cousin has come to visit you. Have you got games on your phone? <laughs> um, all right, so add granulated sugar and the brown sugar and mix with a whisk for one minute. No, so you're going to have to time it. Where's the sugar? Yeah, I can time it. Elise, where'd you put the sugar? Where's the serial killer flower? Where's the serial? <laughs> I forgot, I forgot about that. <laughs> hey, why do you guys hate my flower so much? It's just AP flower. You took, you took the biggest fucking sharpie you could. Oh, yeah. You didn't, you didn't like slow down or anything to make it legible. You're just like, yep, this is what it's doing. You don't need to read it. Only I do. That's all that matters. Dude, my mom and I were trying to bake something. Armor piercing flower. <laughs> Out of there. In this house, most likely all armor piercing. Yeah. JD says, How is it you live with an artist yet you were the one who wrote on the box? Because he didn't wait for me to get home this <laughs> guy. At least doesn't cook. <laughs> Yeah. If you got a thank you card from us, that was written by Elise. It was not written by me. It was really weird to write the thank you cards to the people in his family. I didn't know what's at all in my life. I'm like, I don't know who you are, but we love you. <laughs> uh, Will says, where do you keep the H-E flower? Where do I keep the, the H-E flower? <laughs> I keep that in its own container. It's very volatile. <laughs> you, make, you laugh, but flower... Because it's a bunch of little granules, burns really easily. Mm -hmm. So it actually can. It is actually all flour. So it's like cornmeal. And stuff. Yeah. Like sawdust is like the biggest fire hazard of anything. What movie was it that they made a bomb? Was that one of those? Uh... I don't know. Domestic terrorist. No, no. Because it was one of those like one man army type guys. Oh, that it was probably like the Punisher or some shit. No. Uh, it was one of the older movies. You watched it, your parents played it. There was a hurricane, I think. Oh, that was, um... There was a hurricane? Was that Equalizer 2? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> That's all I remember. I think there was... Well, I mean, I could be getting mixed up, but I thought there was a scene where certain families were facing the same Well, there's yeah, one... that's... Yeah, that's him. ...video on YouTube of uh, someone shooting sawdust into the air using a big compressed air And then thing. it fucking ignites. And then it ignites, yeah. yeah. That's it's cool. Oh, my God. That was an old video. Mm-hmm. Well, then you got the fucking FPS Russia uploading a video where he fires a fucking... ...boat at a bridge, and you see the door go right by him. That's <laughs> terrifying. <laughs> I gotta mix till the sugar's all gone. I don't know how to check if the sugar's fucking gone, but I gotta mix till the sugar's all gone. Stick your whole finger in there. What's... <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> yeah. Instructions <laughs> unclear. Dick stuck in toaster. All right, in a separate bowl now, I have to mix everything else. What'd you look at that? Separate bowl. Will says you could do stuff like that now that you have a first aid kit and a fire extinguisher. Yeah. <laughs> uh, add a granulated sugar and mix. Add a medium sized bowl. Add the flour, cocoa powder, kosher salt, baking soda, and mix. Okay. Then a cup of flour. Here it comes, everybody. Here comes your favorite thing in the whole kitchen. Actually, it's not even AP flour anymore. It's rubbed off. It's AI flour. It's intelligent. <laughs> um, what else do I fucking need? Cocoa powder, baking soda. Do I have baking soda? Should I have baking soda? Uh, baking powder, baking soda. Why am I mixing in a kosher salt? All right. I don't know why I scrolled down. I need that page. I keep turning away from it because I'm a psycho. Anyways. Uh, medium sized bowl, flour, cocoa powder, kosher salt, baking. All right. I don't have kosher salt, so we're using Morton's. It's a Morton's household. Because <laughs> I own stock in them. Oh, 
That's still my my TeamSpeak avatar. You sent it to me like years ago, and it's still my TeamSpeak avatar. Mm -hmm. It's a little. I saw that guy falling down the stairs drinking a beer. And he catches it, which is the best part. Oh, no, he drinks it the whole way down the stairs <laughs> as he's falling. I don't even know how he did it. One half cup cocoa powder. So I... we went all out, boys. I got Ghirardelli everything. JD oh. says, does this mean the, uh, the bread isn't kosher? No. I'm sorry to the dude who said shalom earlier, but I'm not making kosher bread. And then, my, and actually, I don't think that actually has a difference to it. Um, my dad says, "There's a mid. Here's a Midwest throwback. My mechanical drafting teacher was a consultant on several grain elevator fires. He was impressed on how flammable flour was. Yeah, that's yeah. Like uh, grain silos are like the the number one danger to farmers because they they back up, they fall over, they're, they're, they're death traps. All right." I know I normally spoon it in. I don't care anymore. I can't, if you don't give me a fucking gram measurement, I'm doing the cheap way and I'm just going to fucking spoon it. I don't care anymore. I don't blame you. Motherfucker. This is a quarter cup. Where's my half cup? I need a half cup of cocoa powder. My, my my half cup is full of yogurt. Uh, new applications for emotional support wife are in the chat. Okay. It hasn't been six months. An annulment works. And you know, we don't have to be married for you to be emotional support wife. It's been almost six months. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. We're in October. And uh, you want to hear a fun omen? Uh, like the dried just... flowers that we had from her bouquet and my boutonniere fell off a wall yesterday on Friday and shattered. So it's currently being held together with gorilla glue and tape. Yeah. Will asks, Will you feed me? No. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's right. Elise is right. Well, see the apron behind me for the response to that question. This, this isn't gonna work. Yeah, that's not gonna. Work. Ooh. <laughs> I'm doing good. I just, I just, mm -hmm. <laughs> just gonna. No, 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 no! Oh no! I got most of it in there. A cup of flour, a half cup. Oh, fucking cocoa powder. This is going to be some chocolatey fucking bread. Hey, it's got chocolate chips. What's wrong with that? It is double chocolate. That is the whole name of it. Yeah. Uh. You're so rude. I don't like you're going to buy every time I do <laughs> Meg and I do pumpkin bread every October. Mm -hmm. Go to their house. This is a banana house. This is a banana bread house. None of your whore pumpkin bread. Wow. <laughs> I do. See, that, that's why we normally try to keep the attacks pointed in. Yeah. You have to, like, laser him. Pumpkin is the bread of the whore. <laughs> wow. Yeah. It's still spell your name wrong. Fucking they have yet to mess it up. All right, that was what, Sylvain? Yeah. Uh, my brother bought the plate and the flight tickets for us, and uh, sift the dry grains into the wet. Okay, so I'll sift those and the brown sugar. Okay. <laughs> Flour, cocoa powder, coach salt, baking soda, and mix. I, won't. I tried to be lazy. It won't work. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. So, family was traveling to Maine. My brother, who plans all of our family vacations because it's, that's, he's very good at it. Um, bought everybody's plane tickets. 
so we'd all be on the same flight. And he, he emailed me, or he texted me, Brandon, or he called me, sorry, Brandon, what is, what's Elise's middle name? It's Elaine. It's made up. It's Elaine. It is a made up name her mom gave her that's a mixture of her grandmother's names. Okay. We get the plane tickets the day of. Elise Sylvain. <laughs> <laughs> It sounds like you need to pronunciate a little bit better over the phone yeah. to your brother. <laughs> um, had the chocolate chip. Okay, sit yeah. the dragons. <laughs> yeah, she was freaking out. She was like, "Why they don't let me get on the plane?" And I was like, "They don't give a flying fuck." I don't know. You kind of have your soul scared into by some of those people taking tickets. Like, mm-hmm. So we're sifting in our ingredients. So there's no lumps, even though it's a lumpy banana. We're not gonna have any. No, it didn't. Joking. Don't scare me like that. I'm gonna crush what's left over in there, because I want all the sweet cocoa powder in there. Those are just nibs. Those nibs. <laughs> uh, and then we're gonna whisk into well combined. Oh, it's getting thick, boys. I, I like how it says mix until almond combined. This is such a like online recipe. You know where I got this recipe from? Where's that? An Instagram reel. Oh my god! So you know autocorrect is all up in there. Yeah. <laughs> the the fucking the fucking English in this recipe is on. <laughs> <laughs> I think all your dry mix is inside of your whisk there. This is going to be a thick fucking bread. I said still almost combined. Fuck that. <laughs> My hands are so chocolatey right now. Oh, it tastes good though. And how much chocolate chips? 49 chocolate chips. Damn. No. A cup of chocolate chips. Seven. <laughs> Got him. How's the chat doing, Nelson? That's good. Um, Will's still on uh, Will You Feed Me. Yes, Will, I'll fucking feed you. As you can see, I'll feed all you fuckers. <laughs> oh, that is a satisfying sound. All right. Let's mix those in. You still on overhead game? I am. This feels more like a fucking... Like brownie batter than it does banana bread. It does kind of look like a brownie batter. It's so fucking thick. <laughs> it smells delicious, though. It smells just like banana bread. Get that out of there. It's still stuck in the Nelson, ends. Nelson, with gape. <laughs> oh, no. I don't know how we got kicked off of Twitch. <laughs> Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh, oh my God, that tastes so good. All right. So, I'm going to line. I bought a baking pan just for it's Okay, here's the fun thing it just says a loaf pan. Mm. So, I, I own two. I own a big one, a big wide one. Loud noises. More loud noises. Sorry. Wild noise. Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking break something. We're gonna go with our wide flat one. Instead of the glass one. The glass one's alright, but it, it makes really tall banana breads, and I don't think this one's meant to be tall. Uh, so what we're gonna do is a trick I saw online. So they want you to line it with parchment paper. So you wet the inside. 
Get out your parchment paper. I don't need all that. That didn't work. <laughs> I'm just gonna line this bitch so it doesn't stick. You need a pair of scissors. I pretty much do. I mean, it's got a non stick coating, but who the fuck cares? Now, where's spatula? Where'd I put my spatula? There's my spatula. <laughs> All right. Let's get this goo in here. We need a spatula cam. That'd be a heavy spatula. <laughs> get, go to your home. You're supposed to stick because I sprayed the inside. Fucking struggle cam now. Swift Badger says, sup, Brum Daddy. Uh, Brum Daddy and fam. Brum Daddy is my father. <laughs> We're going to get our... Banana bread in here. Our very thick banana bread. Oh my. <laughs> he says mine too. From from daddy is your daddy. Uh, as you can see from my Discord name, I am Brum I am Mr. Brumbar. My daddy is Brum Daddy. My dad, my dad is Brum Daddy. <laughs> your daddy. Your zaddy. My zaddy. So we got our delicious banana bread and our very professionally papered parchment paper. You need a pair of scissors. You gotta make that. Shut up! Bad. Shut up, Mindy! No, I have scissors over here. I'll try it up. The idea is that it's easy to get it out of there because you can just grab the sides. Okay. Yeah, but won't they, uh, they won't Tear? be a little crispy in the edge. Probably. Right now everyone's going to grade my arts and crafts. My arts and crafts, yeah. arts and crafts time. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, Swift Badger Are says. Like, Alright. Swift Badger says, no, nah, just let it burn. Adds a smoky flavor to the bread. For the matter. <laughs> Add the chocolate chips lightly mixed. Pour the batter into a parchment lined bit and top the batter with extra chocolate chips. I mean, if you insist, if you insist homie. <laughs> no! Oh my God, dude. We had four onions, four garlic, four bananas, and now we have four chocolate chips. Did you shut up? <laughs> <laughs> Get out from between the paper, you fucking chip. I don't know where they went. I gotta find them because Jasper can't eat them. Um. <laughs> how many? How many chips is too much for the top? Mm, I don't think there is such thing as too many chocolate chips. I don't know, bro. There's a lot of chocolate chips on there. All right, I think that's enough. <laughs> We're going to pop this into the oven for 55 minutes. Okay, Google. Set a timer for 55 minutes. Second timer for 55 minutes. And we're starting now. <laughs> Goddamn. All right. <laughs> she gets melty. Um, so, pardon the audio. No, what we need, Nelson, is a dedicated fucking kitchen, a sink cam. Oh, yeah. Everyone loves sink cam. You got GoPros, you can just stick them right in there. <laughs> GoPros. We have to warranty one of them. What happened? Sink cam, sink cam. <laughs> Pardon me, really quick while I give myself food poisoning. Uh. <laughs> Mm 
It's tasty. It's so It good. looks good. It, I mean, you can't go wrong with basically what is a cake batter. It's more like a brownie batter. It's cake batter with, uh, with a banana in it. <laughs> Here, I'll get the high quality version. There you go. It's so HD. It's so <laughs> HD. <laughs> even oh, even having it streamed back down into the monitor. It's no, so no, HD. No. <laughs> I want you to be able to count the taste buds on my tongue, bitch. No. You probably could have. I have. This is the one problem with the stream. All the fucking dishes. And you know what the fun part is? We could stop right there. But I chose to make it even more complicated, didn't I, Nelson? Oh, no. We have to make an appetizer. So not only we're we doing lunch or uh, an entree and a dessert like normal, or like with the pizzas where we did a, um, an entree and a an appetizer. Chocolate. Oh, Jasper, he's back. He's gotta run from the demons. <laughs> <laughs> You're my Well, I may grab another drink here in a second. Oh, thank you. God help me, I don't think I need flour, brown and granulated sugar for fucking stuffed mushrooms, but we'll find out here in a second. I like cook cooking. I like cooking. I like cooking. <laughs> I like cleaning up the kitchen. Before I start on something new, let's check on our goulash. It's going a little heavy right now, so we're going to turn it down to low again. I just saw your St. Javelin sticker up there. Do you like my St. Javelin sticker? I do like your St. Javelin sticker. The 1911 I bought yesterday came with a six hour sticker. I need to add inside of that. Also, six hour, sponsor me, please. <laughs> your shit's so expensive. When you have a moment, Nelson. Refresh me on the numbers. Um, 12. Of course. Uh, this had peppers in it. As long as it wasn't raw beef. I just hit myself in the eye with a pepper-laced bowl. <laughs> <laughs> One would recommend advising. It really hurt. Um, all right. So that's going. How's your dad doing? Your dad hasn't said anything in a while. Uh, I think he's doing all right. So we're gonna get our mushrooms ready. That is alarm number one for the goulash. So let's throw our patats and our carrots in, everybody. She's looking chunky. She's smelling fantastic. We'll give this a stir. Beef's looking tasty. Not fall apart tender. You want that after this second cook. And we'll throw our potatoes in. We had to move the camera. I'm sorry, but you're not missing much. I'm just pouring potatoes in. It smells good. It smells so fucking good. And then I believe I have to get this back up to a boil. Get that heat going. Let me check that recipe real quick. Authentic goulash. Return my ball reducing heat. I'm not doing medium. Um, yeah, medium on that would be a fucking nightmare. Uh, we'll let that keep going. We're doing good. It's not a good day. Oh, God. The mushrooms, they just had... <laughs> My dad said, we made a lobster ravioli with a sherry cream sauce while you were making the cake. Your dad. Eric, see, that's the problem with you. You don't, you, you gotta, you're putting a show on. You can't just make something. You gotta talk. You gotta potentially cut yourself for views. <laughs> you gotta put on stupid outfits and feed all these fuckers. <laughs> um so we're getting our good i almost said good news our Can't goulash grill stream we when grill it's summer we're definitely doing one during the fourth of july yeah 
Um, do a big one. Yeah, well, that'll have all the boys. And we can do that outside so we can use the shotgun. Yeah. Shotgun. Um, all right. So I need to remove the stems from all my mushrooms. Uh, here in where I live, I don't. they don't sell baby mushrooms. I'm assuming they just mean small mushrooms. So I had to get a pound and a half of small mushrooms. There you go. So, pardon me while I organize my dirty kitchen sink real quick. So I have more room. Emotional support wife was very nice last week. She did all the dishes. Poggers in chat for emotional support wife. You know I hasn't been here? You talked a mad fucking game. No, I haven't seen that. Tom. Tom talk. Tom talk. Yeah, mad where fucking is Tom? Game every time. Where the fuck's Tom? DK Tom. Piece of shit. He he doesn't want anything to do with you after the last stream. Yeah. <laughs> we heard his reputation. It was, it was too traumatic. I'm glad that the sun stays out longer now. Cake! Huh? The, uh, the sun stays out longer now. From yeah. the light. Yeah. Well, that's great, except for the fact that it gets in the way of the fucking... Actually, it looks good. I have to backlit a little bit. We got our potatoes in there. Waiting this to come back up to a burl. And then we'll throw it back on medium. And then I have to hunt down the fucking bay leaf. You want you want you you like the taste of bay leaf, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, you can just have it. I don't want to hunt it down, so you can just eat the bay leaf. So what we're doing is we're gonna pull the caps off, the little cores of them out. And uh, so rub off any of the, the dirt. You son of a bitch. <laughs> I missed how that happened. No, Jasper. Mm -hmm. I threw it in the thing and it bounced off. Um, so we're taking the stems out, getting any dirt off, and we're taking the stems out. The tops of them go onto a baking sheet. And the idea is that we're going to We're going to cook them. No, uh, this one broke, but I'll just chop that one and throw it up in there. Um, the idea is you uh, cook down the stems because they're a little bit woodier, and then you mix it with cream cheese. That is aggressively boiling, Brandon. What the fuck are you doing? <laughs> it's making noise, too, and my monkey brain is just like, no. <laughs> Cover that up. Throw it back on low. Medium low. What? Dad uh, says you put a lid on the goulash, and you just did. So. I did Mom. Fun part is if I ever said that to my mom, just like in that tone, she'd beat my fucking skull. <laughs> um, and we're just, yeah, we're just preparing our appetizer. Our appetizer is going to be a delicious, like, cream cheese and Parmesan stuffed mushroom with, you know, the cooked stems. The outsides will be nice and soft. This was going to be a, a better appetizer for Meg, because I know that she doesn't like beef, so I was hoping that these could be a nice, mm -hmm. healthy dinner. This fucking room is caked up, dude. <laughs> yeah, it is. Got a fucking little bread on it. Desperate times, at least. You gotta help the homies out whenever you can. <laughs> All right, so yeah, now we're now we're back into the just menial task portion of the fucking stream. Dirty fucking mushroom. Yeah, the sky shows up. <laughs> Bye. Grayson was teasing me about that all fucking day yesterday. Oh, yeah? Yeah, at the office. He's like, Brumbar, don't worry if they get mad at you. You can beat up a four-year-old, you can beat up these guys. And I was like, shut up. <laughs> shut up, Grayson. <laughs> you dick. Uh, music still going? Yep, it is still going. Fantastic. And you're still going strong. <laughs> so strong, everyone. 
Every time I try to check it on the app, it just sends me to an ad. Uh, yeah, I can't turn those off. I apologize for that, but you cannot turn off the intro ads. You can only um, turn off during stream ads. So either you have it play an ad a set amount of after a set amount of time, or you can act you can push them whenever you want. So I have it turned on to where I have to manually turn them on. I have to I have to manually activate them for an ad to play, and then just never play an ad because I, I mean I could, but with only like less than twenty people watching or less than, you know, like 100 people watching. I'm not really going to make anything from it. It inconveniences you guys, and I'm, I'm not really here for the money. If it blows up, yay. But I'm not really here for the money. I'm just here to share some cool recipes with folks, talk to you guys. And it's just kind of fun to do the uh, all of the, the filming and, and everything. Oh, yeah, no, I wanted an excuse to buy a nice camera. So I've always, had, I've always wanted that excuse. Um, And then, you know... I I like to think I know how to talk to people, but sometimes I'm, I'm kind of introverted. So this gives me a good outlet to stress in terms of talking to you guys. You know, we all hang out. We get to know each other. Because sometimes playing arm is just not enough to know the homies. Um, and, you know, it, I, I get to cook new stuff. Uh, I get, you can ask Elise, I cook the same stuff pretty much every week. Because she doesn't, she, yeah, she's not a, she's not a huge, like, food-oriented person. I am. I love food, but I just cook the shit that I know, one, isn't going to kill me, and two, is just tasty. Yeah, a lot of the food I cook is purely just because it gives good leftovers, because... My uh, my dad said, uh, I will match any World Central Kitchen donations during the stream. Any what Central was? World Central Kitchen. I'm not... I think, I think it's... Isn't it one of those, like, nonprofits that feeds... Or teaches people to cook. I don't know. I'm not entirely sure. He's good for you it. Might, you might have to explain that to us. He's good for it. Don't worry. What should be the next donation? Is like five thousand dollars. <laughs> yeah, some big dick YouTuber just rolled up, and they were like, "Oh shit." Your dad's like, "I didn't have. I didn't want to break out the black Amex today, but I will not be outdone." I uh, forgot to uh, qualify. Nothing over a hundred bucks. <laughs> Nothing over a hundred bucks. <laughs> I'll hold you to that, Eric. Quickness. Change my PayPal to be called World Kitchen. <laughs> almost done. We're, um, we're almost done. So many fucking mushrooms. You guys better fucking like mushrooms. <laughs> I know you don't, so we're kind of. They're fucked. okay. You're gonna be eating mushrooms for a while, though. Even, even if I helped a lot. Calling up my neighbor, Tish. You like mushrooms? <laughs> That's what I did with the uh, the giant fucking cookies that we made. Yeah. After the stream, I uh, texted her. I was like, Tish, uh, do you like dark chocolate? And she was like, I love dark chocolate. What's up? I was like, are you home? I am. I'll be there in two minutes. And we brought her three of those. Oh, no. Three of those giant fucking. <laughs> it was the stem. Three of those giant fuck off uh, cookies that we made. The Le Levere cookies. Yeah. And I just like, I watched the like the light return to her eyes. Because she was grading tests before that. Oh, yeah. She was not having a good time. All right, so we have a delicious plate of mushrooms. Big clump of dirt. Big clump of dirt. We're going to take this on a medium skillet over high heat. We're going to cook down our mushrooms. Oh, God. I'm about to crack my noggin. Are you simmering? Simmer a little harder. Uh, I think we're done with all the prep phase. Of this. Butter. How much butter? Are you? Two tablespoons. Oh, brother, I got two tablespoons of butter right fucking here, bro. Right fucking here, bro. <laughs> right. a whole ass stick. That's the little one. 
Yeah, move the camera, camera boy. We're done with all the prep now. Um, what all am I doing here? Add garlic to cook it till fragrant. I need to chop these stems up real quick, so I don't know why I'm doing that. Oh. I'm singing in the rain. You know, it kind of breaks the immersion when you're in the shot. Could you <laughs> walk off? We're going to mince these motherfuckers up. I'm going to walk past you with a knife. <laughs> Don't stab yourself. Don't stab yourself with the knife in your hand. I mean, don't turn around and get stabbed. <laughs> Smart ass. <laughs> that can also be seen that way. It won't make me stab you. So we're just roughly mincing this up. Come on, well, you little bastard. Well, Nelson struggles with fucking B cam. Your dad's like, oh, I got, we got hungry again, so I made a four-course lobster dinner for me and your mother. All the time it took you to peel those mushrooms. <laughs> I caught it. Maybe I think it's one of those things that you guys can do like three. Yeah, no, I'd lose. Because he knows all these little tips and tricks. Plus, he's got Nelson's mom on his side. Nelson's mom's a monster in the kitchen. I'm sorry, I'm not a domestic dog. You don't need to be. Yeah, there we go. Don't knock that over. <laughs> oh, I'm definitely, I'm definitely knocking that over. That's definitely getting fucking knocked over. I hate to tell you. So you know we're not going. <laughs> Swift Badger says, "Whoa, budget's going up here. New slave labor, I see." I'm... Swift Badger says, "I don't want to see the help." I <laughs> oh God. Did you go into sleep mode? I just see a Warhammer figure. <laughs> what? Yeah. Hello. You somehow switched monitors, you goon. You're on the other monitor now. How did I do that? How do I switch back? I don't know. I don't know the Steam Link settings. You go upstairs and look at the monitor. <laughs> Hopefully stream's still running. Excuse me. <laughs> I, it should be. It, it shouldn't have affected anything. Uh, here, I can just... Here, uh, let me Google real quick. And make sure you're still going. Small. Technical difficulty, everybody. Yeah, you're still going. Uh, I'm sorry if I missed the All right. plus one. I believe there is a setting you could choose which monitor would leave the big picture on at work. Uh, to switch the segment rather than the several monitors. Uh, I'm sorry, I missed the one virtual here. What the fuck? Yeah, how did you do that? I didn't touch anything. How did you? Yeah, because it's just switched to the other fucking monitor. Oh, now it's on the right one again. Yeah, I just switched the window to the other monitor. Oh, so you just moved it? Yeah. I mean, whatever worked. That's the easiest fix I can think of. All right, sorry. This is a high quality stream here, everybody. <laughs> Yeah, like everyone's saying, like, yeah, you got to do this, 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 this. And I was like, Nelson definitely didn't do that. No, I didn't touch anything. Oh, this one's not 2K, is it? No, that one's only that one's only 1080p. So your, your view's going to be a little shittier. You don't get a fucking choice seeing as you broke it. I didn't touch anything. 
Get our mushrooms in there and get those sauteing, get a little moisture out of those. Left my phone upstairs. You're falling apart. Huh? Sharp knife, Brandon. Sharp knife. Get on there. How many cloves of garlic do I need, game? Game? Two minced cloves of garlic. Producer's falling apart, everybody. If you'd like to be the new producer, please email me at Big Brum. What happened? Oh, I figured out how to do it. You just keep the mouse to one side of the screen. Oh, and it, it'll pop over there. I gotcha. Uh, my grandma says, uh, hello. You. I forgot your grandma's name. <laughs> Hi, Grandma. <laughs> is it your... It's your mom's mom, isn't it? Yeah, that's what I thought. Mm. Yeah, her husband threatened to beat my ass every time he saw me. Yep. He had this thing about wanting to beat up dudes who were bigger than him. Because he was a boxer, and he definitely could beat my ass at one point in time. But we'd just be sitting there, and he'd be like... I bet I could knock the shit out of you. And I'll be like, what the fuck? <laughs> so we're we letting go. those stew. You have a good, a... Oh, you got a good dual cam action. Good angle there. I can see both. Yeah. A little aggressive. We're going to turn that down. So we're letting these saute down. Getting all the moisture out of them. While I'm over here... Minth and garlic. We're not going to cheat for this one because I have time. Do you? Shut up, Lindsay. <laughs> this is just weird. You know that? How so? That we have the technology today for all of our friends to be in the kitchen with us. And just I can just sit here cooking, and it's easily gettable. I can buy a camera. I have a good enough internet, and I can just do this. That's pretty cool. And if I if I watched my mouth, I'd be happy to send this to my family, and they can knowing them like they'll call out like tips, stuff to do. Like my brother's an incredible smoker of meats. Um, <laughs> and his wife. Oh my. God, she's like pure blood Italian. And when we go to their house from dinner, it is always incredible. Um, so that's nice. But then you know, I get to come home and also cook the shit that I like. Because I kind of like more simpler meals. So like one of my favorite meals is just chicken and rice. I'll do, uh, I got the breasts, cut them in half, pound them down so they're even, throw a little, uh, seasoning on them throw a very thin layer of light olive oil on top take them outside of the grill grill them and then throw like a thin layer of barbecue sauce on them and it's just that's that's happy place that is like one of my favorite fucking meals it's just chicken and rice and i i probably piss off people with how i eat rice i like rice with like uh like chili sauce in it and uh, Elise likes it more the traditional way. She likes the soy sauce and um, uh, sesame oil. Mm -hmm. But I did. I, I, I bought a because I couldn't find it in the store because they ran out of it for a while. And I wish I didn't do this, but I do. I own a one. Oh, there goes your beers. I got them. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, to put good. them on the one side that. There's a whole side over here that's open, you goon. <laughs> um, I have a one-gallon jug of sweet red chili sauce with sweet berries because I love it so much. I put it on rice. It's fucking delicious. But I don't worry. I don't administer from the jug to the rice. I use a little squirt bottle. <laughs> Got well, like, it says uh, his internet crashed, so no more op. 
anymore, so he's hanging with us. And uh, my dad says, excellent pan tossing skills. Yeah, you know, you fling enough food across the kitchen, you get you, you learn how to do it right. <laughs> There's been lots of food on the ground tonight. Not from the pan, though. So we're just trying to get the moisture out of these, put a little brown on them. I'm gonna turn the heat up a little bit. We got our olive, our olive, our garlic pre-chopped. Um, and then after that, we're gonna use a large mixing bowl. Hi, Ben. Hey, Bubba. Come here. I lost it. Um, I need a large mixing bowl. Galloway says jazz. Jazz? So we'll bust out the, the mixing bowls that my mom bought me from Target. Year two of college. Ten years ago. Might I remind you, you know, some me and you are. 30. Yeah, I know. Not yet. Yeah, you have a month after me, and I have another month left. Um, these are classics. They've survived every move. My boy, my son, come here. Say hello to Stream. Ooh. Say hello, my son. <laughs> Full That's frame. <laughs> That's my boy. Galloway enjoyed that. That is my boy. Oh, your mouth squeaked. Swift Badger says hi. What's up, Swifty? I know that was for Jasper, but I'm gonna say hi anyway. Ooh, look at that! I got a nice, I got a nice brown developing on my mushrooms. We'll give those another minute. Throw the garlic in. Let that brown, and then. Mushrooms, Parmesan, cream cheese, parsley, and thyme. I have parsley and thyme in here. I have cream cheese in here. And then I have a block of Parmesan that I need to grate real quick. That was the world's worst grab at the refrigerator. I was here and I was like... Um, <laughs> um, this is done. Move. You know what? I'm gonna use a little dish, a little ramekin that I stole from an Olive Garden. A little dishy, stole from an Olive Garden. <laughs> Fuck them. You just put it in the to-go box. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, those are brown, and I'm I can smell them. Your corporate right now. <laughs> Romar has one of your ramekins. Just because. The breadsticks and salad are endless. Doesn't mean the ramekin. The pottery's in. Let's do. The most important says, part's just not getting caught. Galloway says his dad steals cups from places all the time. It's hilarious. He says it's cool looking, uh, uh, or like cool looking pint glasses and stuff. I mean, I I know people who steal silverware from Waffle House. Yeah, I've I've stolen a pint glass. I mean, most of these, if you're buying it from, if you're stealing from a big company, it doesn't work. Yeah. So we're just going to let our garlic get fragrant in there. I don't think I have enough mushroom to stuff into all of the other mushrooms, so we're just going to stuff until we're out. Let that sit for just a hot second while I get out my cheat machine which I wish Sava was here to see it because it would probably trigger him to fuck. A bird just ran into the window. <laughs> Did it really? Yeah. That fat little pigeon. <laughs> Fucking morning doves. Good thing we didn't have the door open. <laughs> we could have some dove with our fucking yeah. Yeah, dinner, dude. Um, everywhere for that. That's done. You can turn that camera off. Throw this into here to cool. Get all our our accoutrement together. So right now, this is just our uh, garlic and mushroom mix. I got a nice brown on the mushrooms. 
I know this is bad for the pan. I don't care. This pan is older than most of you are. It doesn't really matter. <laughs> Take my cheese. I'm going to cut off the rind. And then I'm going to cheat. You know I'm going to cheat, everybody? I'm going to take that piece of cheese. You know? No. <laughs> it was a cheat. Oh, you gotta move your hand. We can't see. And just like that. There you go. Perfectly shredded Parmesan. <laughs> With some fat chunks. People went to school for shit like this. You know that, right? <laughs> there will be no floor Parmesan. It's a cool little... Uh, I love this little fucker. It, it's got a big grater, a little grater, and a slicer. Interesting. The only problem is there's like a tiny little hole, or there's like a tiny little gap. Where big piece of cheese gets stuck in, but it's not really negative because I could eat the cheese. <laughs> so. Grayson says he's finally home now. Yay. Welcome back, Grayson. Welcome to the safety of your home. <laughs> Cooking up your food. I need to have more than one kitchen. How else am I going to feed all these fuckers? You're throwing your food on the ground. <laughs> I'm in your kitchen spilling shit on the I didn't set another timer. Did I? Okay, Google. How much left on my timers? T minus 22 minutes and two seconds. I didn't set a second timer. For the potatoes um i'll just let when that one goes off because it happened it should be fine i'll check them yeah the biggest thing is the potatoes are cooked through not a word anyways all right what am i doing now oh i didn't season with salt and pepper i'll put it in the bowl where's the bowl where's the bowl a large bowl mixed the parmesan cream cheese parsley and thyme how much Parmesan do I need? One quarter cup freshly grated Parmesan. This is shredded Parmesan. Wait, what was that? It wants grated Parmesan, which is like very fine, like powder. Yeah. Time to get your little wheel of destiny out. Uh, nope, <laughs> I'm gonna get the jar out. Here's the problem though. It's stuck in the fucking bottom. <laughs> We got it. <laughs> um, I shouldn't stick my finger in there. Oh my God, it's rock solid. <laughs> so we uh, we grated that Parmesan for. Uh, you're not gonna use it. Oh, I'm gonna throw this snack and cheese. <laughs> I love cheese. Yeah, <laughs> Grayson says just pretend the bottom of the bottle is a four-year-old. Should be able to get it out pretty easy then. You swear, you swear at one four-year-old, and all of a sudden everyone's <laughs> a fucking jokester. God damn it! Come on. Jeez. I hope you like great Parmesan. There's a lot of fucking Parmesan. Go to your home. Go back to your fucking home. All right. I don't have much time left. How much, how much are these things going to bake, bake, bake for? They bake for 30 minutes. These are going to be done way after the... No, 20 minutes. How much? Got to get it together. You know what? You don't get fresh time in... Or... <laughs> Rosemary! Your Food Network cooking show. You've only got 20 minutes. <laughs>
So I'm gonna know. All right. Hey, look at that. I freshly jarred those this morning. Cream cheese. Cream cheese. Cream cheese. I was I, legitimately, I about took a knife to this whole fucking box, and I'm not kidding. <laughs> Speed mode. <laughs> We're not eating banana bread on stream. Well, I'll cut it. I can cut into the last second, but it needs to cool for like 30 minutes. All right, four ounces cream cheese. How much? No, somebody could tell me these things. Elise, can you come over here and grab a... I'll do it. I don't know what I'm asking you. No. I'm just being paranoid. Not paranoid, but lazy. Oh. <laughs> Nilson, I'm sad. Gotta go. My hero, or my, my hero. Uh, my dress up darling is old. Oh, no. And it was such a good anime. Hmm. You, you can still, uh, you can still watch uh, Battle for Galactica. With I'm you. not watching Star Galactica. <laughs> you made me watch fucking Stargate SG-1. And... Oh. I did. I, it was great. I loved it. You would really like. Uh, I know I would, but then you win. <laughs> I also got you to watch The Expanse. I fucking love The Expanse. Yeah. Two parsley, just two parsley, just two whole fucking parsley. Give me your secrets. Is that a, how many tablespoons? Ta two tablespoons first. That's a lot of parsley. Get out of the fucking bottle! I'm gonna die. That was a nice series of songs. <laughs> yeah. Broke the dab off. They yeah, don't need it. In my, in my rage. I'm like Vader. In my <laughs> rage, I killed that like her for the most. The, the parsley fucking top. And then one tablespoon freshly chopped thyme. Chop, chop, chop. There you go. Now I know not to grab it from the little plastic tab. I don't know. I'm, I don't know why you put those little plastic things in there. They're useless. They put, they put the little holes in them. Yeah. And like the pieces are way too big to even fit to the holes. I don't know why they. Just to annoy you. Just to annoy you. <laughs> All right. How should I mix this? Do you have advice? The engineer is back. Hi, Inger. Is that while still cooking? It's got to be three hours long. How am I, How do they expect you to mix this? Gracie says they do it for bay leaves, too. It's so cringe. They do what for bay leaves? What are you talking about, Grayson? Grayson, explain. Explain to me. Explain yourself. Right now, I just have some very herby cream cheese. Nothing else is really <laughs> Oh, the part! He says plastic caps with tiny holes. Oh, yeah. They do that for, yeah, they did that for the cream. They did that for the bay, bay leaves. leaves when I first opened yeah. it. Too. It confused the shit out of me. How, am I supposed to, like, microwave this? How do you expect the cream cheese to mix with all this shit? Probably because the... Mushrooms are supposed to be hotter when you throw them in there. Engineer, do you have a good time pushing rocks up and down? Rubber coated rocks. <laughs> he said the sad voices in head did go away. 
It's such a sad meme, though, that people have to, like, talk like that because the world's gone to such shit. Mm-hmm. Uh, Kidlow, you okay, buddy? It's been a while. You haven't said anything. <laughs> Kidlow, check. Did you see they, 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 like, the first major city the Russians took, they've lost control of already? That doesn't surprise me. That, that, that's such it's a like shit show. Or something. Yeah. And then fucking Biden. <laughs> Just give up. My political rocket engineer says, say it's not so. Political on freedom. All right. So I'm gonna. What's on the floor? What is on the floor? Nothing. <laughs> I'm gonna put cream cheese mushroom mix into. I don't have enough for all of them, but I'm gonna fill some of the bigger ones. <laughs> I'm Shut up, Mimsy. I'm glad I got to watch that twice. Shut up, Mimsy. <laughs> so we're just cramming. Cream cheese and I feel it feels kind of weird shoving cream cheese back into the or shoving mushrooms back into the mushroom. I was a little forceful with this one. It was a mushroom popper, essentially, of a jalapeno. Yes, yeah, pretty much. You love jalapeno poppers. They're tasty. Point. I, I, I don't know how to feel about them. They're good, but. Sometimes you get like a jalapeno that, that didn't, didn't cook, and all you taste is like the raw jalapeno. Which some days I'm perfectly fine eating. Other days I'm like, I came here for a fucking popper, and I've been betrayed. So we're just stuffing some cream cheese into these, some cream cheese and mushroom mix back into these mushrooms. You don't have to, you're not making a huge mound. You're just trying to, like most of us in this life, the hole. <laughs> Fill the void. Fill the void. God, it is so windy. It is outside. really windy. How's everybody doing? Art dude's at fucking work and he doesn't tune into these things even though he does nothing at work. Yeah. Engineer, you know how much he does at work. Why isn't he on? Out him. Probably because the internet. I think he said the internet sucks more than anything. Yeah, he's fine. He's sad boy hours. He does. He can't afford his own <laughs> phone plan. So, I like how I thought I could get these done in twenty minutes. Yeah, the dude says it, it's ass at the shop. The government job, so it's ass anyways. Do 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 do. Got a little mushrooms to fill there. I'm not filling all of them. I'm going to fill the bulk of them. I was going to say, it looks like you're running out of... I mean, if I, I could put like a dab of it in each one. But I'm, I'm just trying to like fill them. I mean, I, I love a cooked mushroom just by itself, but this this will be a nice... Engineer says he has to preload uh, YouTube before uh, dinner when I work night shift. Oh, God. Is it just there's no signal out there? Yeah. I keep leaning up against the um, uh, dishwasher that's against me. It's, it's it's down at ball area. It keeps making weird, like, wet, squelchy noises, and it's creeping me out. <laughs> Grayson says, Am sad that with uh, Nilsson in charge, I can no longer do Art Father. You can no longer do Art Father? But now I can hit you with the Onisan, like, full weed. Oh, so God. Oh, God. I don't know why I've always been Nissan. I think I started with Davidson, actually. I wonder how many hentai games he plays. Nissan. I'm surprised you weren't Nissan earlier. Nissan. That's why if you look in the Rangers of the Round Table, there's that. It's a picture of a Nissan. <laughs> the Nissan logo in there. Who knew a bunch of guys playing fucking armor were a bunch of weebs? Everyone's a weeb these days. Everyone should be a weeb at least for a little bit so you can understand a different culture. 
All right, I think that's all she wrote for the stuffed mushrooms. And again, I think this is made for like big mushrooms, like big baby mushrooms. I couldn't find like bigger mushrooms. So you wouldn't have to fill so many of them. Engineer says, you've seen Wallpaper Engine. Hey, everybody. If I see you on Wallpaper Engine, I don't care if you're looking for cool stuff. In my head, you're looking for <laughs> Should I just roast these off? It's not like I don't have enough mushrooms to eat. This is a lot of fucking mushrooms. That is a lot of mushrooms. Well, because I thought Meg was coming and she wouldn't be able to eat po uh, fucking beef. So I was I was hoping. Sorry about that. <laughs> rat bastard. <laughs> Season was all bake until mushrooms are soft, the tops are golden. <laughs> Grayson says, I think my most played game is wallpaper engine. You degenerate. Or sorry, that's not the proper way of saying it. It's you de degenerates like you belong on a cross. <laughs> Engineer says, a mood. So I gotta top these with more parmesan. I sprinkle that uh, grated parm on there. That's what the just shredded? Yeah, just, just throw it at it. Like three shreds of Parmesan on each one. <laughs> now, I actually bought two of these jars. Not accidentally, but I bought two of these jars on the, um, for the pizza thing. So now I have a bunch of grated Parmesan. So just let me use it. Grayson says he's only a D-Gen for Onisan and Brumbusi. Ban him. <laughs> Ban him. Get him out of here. Get that degenerate out of here. Fucking DMP. <laughs> You're barred. You're barred. You're out. That's right. Now with me and you running the unit, we can call it Rumbard. You've been Rumbard. Yeah. Where you get kicked out. You you just watch two streams before you to play hey, a show, show the show the main cam your uh You know, I wasn't really thinking. I can't put these in there till cake come out. Oh. <laughs> I thought it'd be done by now. What's the timer left on the... Uh... Okay, Google, how much time's left? Less than three minutes, I guarantee you. Seven minutes Fuck! <laughs> Never mind. Well, we have time to clean up, everybody. Hey, let's take a look at the, uh, the goulash you got going on in there. What ow. Yeah, let me stir it. <laughs> yeah, give her, give her a good stir. All the goos at the top. We'll check our potatoes here in seven minutes, see how they're doing. But that, boys, is looking like a delicious Hungarian goulash. Here. You're a little askew because you were in mushroom can. Let me. I'll adjust I, I it. I tightened even. it up, yeah. Ooh, Galloway says it looks good. Oh! oh. <laughs> Focus! There we go. We almost said phone stew. Oh, no. So, the mushrooms will be done eventually. But we can always have some goulash while they bake. Tom's in. He said, are you done yet? Where have you been, <laughs> you sarcastic asshole? You know what? I'm not going to explain to you what we're doing, Tom. I'm just going to open this container of Parmesan cheese. And I'm going to eat it and stare at you. It's very funky. Ah, Will. Will says, this goulash is making me hungry. Ban him. <laughs> Ban him all. You're not going to have anybody like Ban him all! I hate puns! <laughs> Tom says he was having fun with uh, friends and family. Family reunion. Clean up a little bit. Um, did you show the main cam your mushrooms you just made? Uh, no, I will in a second. Yeah, let's take a look at it. Loud noise. Does, gentlemen, the jokester has arrived. All right. Here's our mushrooms, boys. They have been, the stems taken out, and then their stems have been roast, uh, sauteed, mixed with cheese, herbs, cheese, cheese, herbs, cream cheese, and then restuffed back in there. They're going to be delicious. Tom asks, is this a sponsored stream? What's up with the aprons on the windows? Oh, those were a gift from Wazmek. Uh, he he bought these for me. Uh, I'm really a fan of this one. Nosa likes his butt rubbed and his pulled pork. 
But I love the idea of showing up to a barbecue with your family wearing an apron that just says, I'll feed all you fuckers. Tom also says, I swear to God, Brandon wears the same shit every stream. Excuse you, I have like nine pairs of these cargo shorts, and this I haven't worn since stream one. I've been wearing flannels for the last five streams. Heads up, there will be no stream two weeks from today, because me and Elise will be at the beach. Uh, and I'm taking the camera with, I'm not taking my computer with us to stream from. Um, maybe I'll stream from the beach, because I have my camera. My, my phone, oh, I have my phone cam. So yeah. I can like set up on the back patio, just like a nice view. Yeah. Stream that for a couple minutes. Mm -hmm. um, oh, I haven't drank it so long. Drinking really helps. I yeah. should have been doing this in stream one. Got to finish it. Get, get a new one going. All right, hey, calm down. <laughs> Tom's excited for beach stream. Engineer says no beach episode. No beach. Uh, if I owned a laptop, I would, but I don't own a laptop. So um, I'm not... Are you going to do a hot tub stream on the beach? Do we own? Do I own a... There's only one house that I have access to that has a hot tub. No, on the beach. You're going to go to the uh, the hot tub at the pool? I'm not staying the... in a fucking resort hotel. <laughs> I have standards. Just staying at sandals. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to my personal beach resort. And some fat lady in a one-piece goes waddling by. All-inclusive. All-inclusive. <laughs> I didn't know we got to have kids. My, my dad wants to know what beach. I don't know if you can disclose that information. No, I'm not. I didn't even tell our coworkers. We have a list of all the stuff that we have due and stuff that we go over on Monday, and it just says Brandon on vacation from like February 8th to the 13th. And the, for location, like we bid buildings and stuff. For location for the vacation, it says, "Wouldn't you like to know?" Tom wants to know. Uh, you could do a castaway type cooking stream. You like beat open coconuts and stuff. I'm not going to Hawaii. There's no fucking coconuts in Florida. <laughs> All right, we know the state. <laughs> you fucking traitor. You fucking traitor. You know, I told you, didn't I? Tom says he'll leak the location for 20 bucks. Tom doesn't know jack shit. Engineer, you have a volleyball be the co-host. <laughs> <laughs> and have as much personality as Tom did. Or the producer. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'll just have, I'll set up the camera staring at the, the, like the beach the ball camera. sitting in front, of the, in front of the computer. And just berate him the whole time. He's fucking useless, dude. I can't fuck. I gotta get some help. <laughs> you guys will love Jasper. Uh, I'll send you a picture of Jasper in his two-piece. He's gonna look great. <laughs> yeah, we should probably figure out who's going to come by here and spend time with a cat while we're gone, at least. Tom says, oh yeah, does the panhandle sound fun, Brandon? <laughs> Shut up, Tom. <laughs> Stop talking, Tom. Shut the fuck up, Tom. Man, we had a... Well, we'll have goulash. We'll sit and eat goulash for 20 minutes until the mushrooms are ready. No worries. Uh, Grayson says, at Brumbar, Macklin says he loves you. Hi, Macklin. I love you too, buddy. Oh, God. All right. This didn't have any raw meat on it, so it's fine. These little mushrooms just need to be cooked. Oh. I mean, I'm you doing all right. I'm tired. <laughs> <laughs> um, do I sit here and just unload the dishwasher on stream <laughs> while I'm waiting for shit? Oh, I'm sure you, it, it's only going to be another second or two before that timer goes off. All right. The bread. Five subs if I can be closer to the due time than you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. I said a couple okay, of Okay, Google, stop. <laughs> Fuck you. You don't have a, you don't have a, you don't have you. My dad says redneck Riviera. <laughs> Shut up, Eric. All right. Let's check on our bonanza bread. Um, Hold it oh, up for your beat cam there. Brother. Brother. <laughs> Look at it. <this. laughs> Show it for the camera. I, no, no, fuck camera. I got to I got to I'm, I'm going to. Where's the toothpick? I got to toothpick it first. 
Elise, what'd you do with my toothpicks? Elise? 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 What'd you do with my toothpicks? No, I think they're over there. Um, I think they're over here because I was using them when I was painting. No, I don't use them upstairs. I only use them down here. You guys don't know where I am, but I'm... Walls. That looks so fucking good, dude. It oh does. Oh, my God. Um... Where the fucking toothpicks go? You can use a fork. Uh... Oh, what the fuck's wrong with you? Did I put them on the bottom shelf? I hope you guys are appreciating my pound ass cheeks, will I? <laughs> Where in the fuck and fuck did I put them? I don't even remember what kind of container they're in. Brother, it's fucking struggle bus right now. Where are my fucking toothpicks at? <laughs> That's sesame seeds. Where the? No, son. What'd you do with my toothpicks? I didn't touch them. What'd you do with my toothpicks? Nothing. There's so much shit in here. All right. No, 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 no. My no. dad says just put your finger on it. If it springs up, it's done. Who said that? My dad. I don't trust you. Your dad wants to see me injured. He wants his investment to work when he bought me the shit. Did I just leave the toothpicks sitting outside on the floor? No. Where the fuck? What were you using? Oh, there they are. There. I put them behind shit. They're right here. Uh-oh. My dad's calling. Uh-oh. Eric, I'm sorry. Father. I'm still in the will, right? Yeah, I... I just told him that, but uh, he he did just find the uh, the toothpicks. <laughs> Red's going back in for five minutes. See, I don't know though. That's the thing. But we'll go either we'll go. way. Okay, Google. Ten minute timer. You can stick your mushrooms in there with it. Probably could. Yeah, I don't know. It just depends on what temperature. Uh, what temp? 400. That's the problem. So they're, they're not going to be in the right in? temp. 350. I can just keep them in there longer. Well, I got to move them. The problem is the, the pizza stone that's in there. Oh. On the bottom shelf. Don't die. Don't die. Don't. Chat, don't touch that. It's hot. We're just pre-gaming the mushrooms, you know? Time to check on the doneness of our goulash. So, let me put that there. I need to hunt down a potato. I want a particularly chunky potato. You're chunky. You're brumbar sized. Come here. Get a carrot on there too. All right, chat. It's trippy. Let's see it. Let's see how resistancy our potatoes are. Our carrots. Oh, our carrots. <laughs> Oh, oh. oh no. <laughs> Take a swig of something. <laughs> oh god, it's even hotter on the inside. <laughs> the goulash. <laughs> 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 
Pick the top off of the goulash. I'll, I'll bring it over to camera. I'll bring it over here. Yeah. Camera's already here. There's the goulash, everybody. Ooh. That was so hot. <laughs> <laughs> that was, uh... Yo, shut up. I got a fish out. I'm hoping it's still in one piece. Okay, it is. So this is very much a beef stew. So it's not it's not on the thicker side. My dad said we saw that coming. What, the me burning myself? <laughs> yeah. Supposed to be my friend. Oh. Grayson wants an episode where Brumbar and Dawson just eat a ton of super spicy food. Other I love spicy food. It's not me you have to worry about, it's him. Yeah. I can do about three quarters of what you can do. Yeah, but there's also well, uh, well, doesn't matter. You need enough spicy food. You 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 automatically develop my guess. Yeah. I what I will do a fucking video stream. I don't care. I don't care if we pre-record it and play it on stream of us going to Buffalo Wild Wings and doing their their hottest challenge. Okay. Um, the only problem is I gotta see if you can do it with boneless wings because I hate I don't like. Boneless yeah. Wings. yeah. Um, but if they do that, I'm fucking game because like you see dudes who do that and they're like. It's like, yeah, I mean, this could be easy. And then it cuts to afterwards, and they're out in the parking lot, and their face is lit up, well, and they're drooling. You can always do the hot ones challenge. Oh, that's easy. Yeah, actually, uh, Jared had some. Meg's, uh, yeah. Jared, yeah, my, Meg. Uh, Jared had some at uh, his house the other day. We were there for uh, the gender reveal for his new kid, girl. Um, He had the last dab. He had the new one, the super hot one. Um, I ate it on top of some cocktail weenies. And it, I tell you what, was spicy. But it's it's like, <laughs> there's different kinds of spicy. There's like, hits you and then melts away spicy. There's builds on itself spicy. It's very tingle, tingle, hot, 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 hot. And then you just have a tingle for like 20 minutes. It is, it's got some kick to it. It's I, I thought it tasted, it tasted incredible though. I need to go online and buy the, apparently the Los Calientes one, the middle ones is incredible. Yeah. Yeah, we need to get like the bomb and stuff like that. I'm not trying the bomb, no, because it's 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 not made to be good. It's just made to hurt. Yeah, it's it doesn't. Everyone who tries it says it sucks. I'm not wasting money on it. You don't get any more chalky chips. I need chalky chips to help my mouth. Where my mouth hurts. <laughs> you need a drink. I did drink. All right, goulash is done. Let's move the camera back over. Do it. It came right off. Um, you can go corner? here. Yeah, that's fine. Well, it may block you from that angle. I think it'll sit right in front of you. You still have this camera on? So they could go on a ride. There we go. <laughs> Although it, the angle's not bad right now, but <laughs> stuff going on. Fucking fall apart, here, brother. <laughs> here. You got it? Yeah, I got it. Battery packs on the way. There you go. Um, I would show Jasper, who is adorably sleeping on his cat tower by Nelson. Right now we'll we'll we'll, set, we'll center on the gouge. This smells incredible. It's nice and thick. The veggies are nice and cooked. Um, people are gonna get pissed if I don't show the beef. So let me find a good piece of beef. I'm on the B cam now. Got a little browning from when we cooked the beef earlier. That looks good. <laughs> I wash my hands are fine. <laughs> it's very hot. I'm getting all the juice off. It is quite warm. Are you on big camera or little camera? Uh both. Uh but it is no resistance. Peel apart tender. It is. Oh, good. Oh, my God, dude. 
Hätte ich schon fangen können. Mhm. Barucks, welcome. Barks, you mean? Yeah, Barks. Uh, that is uh, Schnippel, I believe. Then uh, Grayson says, can't tell if it's hot or if you just got weak hands. Grayson, <laughs> where the fuck do you live? And when are you going to be on stream? Because I'm getting sick and tired of the crap talk, all right? Oh, it's uh, Shaq. Mark's just Shaq. I'm sorry, Shaq. You, there's a lot of names I got to remember. I, I apologize for insulting you by calling you Schnitzel. <laughs> all right. Um, um, I don't how, long, how long you got left on your bread? Uh, two minutes? Two minutes, 30 seconds? Okay, Google. How much time is left? One minute, 45. You've got one minute and 52 seconds. Fuck! He's so damn. Damn. Why don't you come up here and post the stream, then, <laughs> Mr. I know time? Grayson wants to know where you're at. If you were a hacker, you'd know you by now. Bitch. Oh, Flopper, thanks for following. I, I, I really hope... Come and tell me if that vine sounds really loud, because it's like the only one that... It's it's super sharp, and it's it's super short. It's harsh. It's just... Bang. But you should really try out the sub sound. It's I changed it, so sometimes another one plays randomly, um, and then there's two donos. Anything over I think ten dollars is a better version of the less than ten dollars sound. And there's also one for bits now, which you'd know. Mm -hmm. But until someone donates bits, I'm not going to tell anybody what it is. Um, Grayson says uh, uh, he's coming to visit next week. Grayson, uh, look at the third site map. Oh, that's right. Forgot. There's a site. Actually, I don't have it linked. Link in the. Uh, don't link it in the Discord. Private message it to me, uh, Grayson. And then uh, Grayson says, "Where, <laughs> where it at do third media? Yeah. Where it at do what? Um, I was in the third media challenge or whatever. Mm -hmm. All right, come get a bowl of goulash, everybody. Yeah, let's do it. Let's see. Come get some goulash." You don't have to be on camera. I will give you a bowl. Uh, that sounded weird. <laughs> uh, per tradition, sour cream on the side. Supposed to put a dollop on top. I'm not going to do it, but they're more than welcome to. A dollop? A dollop, dollop, baby. Yeah, bro, don't hit my fucking shit like that. What's wrong with you? <laughs> You've just been hitting it all day. Oh, I smacked the shit out of that. So much. All right. Bread. Oh, shit. I'm going to move my mushrooms up to the middle. I'm going to push this up to 425 so they can catch up. Oh, shit. I'm gonna fucking... B camera. There you go. Motherfucking bread. The, 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 uh, the recipe for this listed as breakfast. I'm like, you're out of your fucking mind. <laughs> Galloway says, God damn, that looks good. Diddy says, that's some good looking banana bread. Um, I will stop calling you Grayson, uh, Galloway. I, I don't think I did, but. You, you insult my mod like that? And then uh, Will asks, uh, when do we get new stuff uh, for channel points? All right. I have two things I gotta upload for subscriber perks. Um, I keep forgetting. I'm I'm sorry. I'll do it tomorrow. Um, you gotta talk here. They don't, that camera that that mic's not on. Um, I there's a text to chat thing. I think for channel points, I'll have to look. But then again, I don't have a way to hear it. Is the problem? I'd have to put earbuds in. To listen because we don't have a way to monitor because we have no like speakers if we were upstairs in my computer upstairs i'd have my headphones on and i could hear any text to chats i don't have a way to listen down here unless we made like a we got like a bluetooth speaker and put it on the thing um the problem with that is it would play music as well mm. so i need to find a way to bifurcate so the music just goes to the thing you can send it to me. Wait, no, yeah, it yeah, outputs it to cable a and as long as i don't have cable a on uh, voice meter plugged in it shouldn't output at all yeah That should work. 
Well, I'll, tr I'll try to get a speaker down here for text to chats and stuff like that. Um, we try to improve stream every time we have it. So. Uh, that was really forced. That actually kind of hurt. Anyways. Dude. Spoons or forks? Spoon. Fork? What the? Nelson, I'm going to give you the... I'm going to give you the big boys. <laughs> Lisa, you get you get the starfish. No. Got a hold. You're the one. All right. Um Oh yeah. It does look really good. It's mostly potato. I've been smelling it this whole time. Now it smells so good. Thank you, Oven. You want sour cream? Mm, Mickey and bull. Don't don't touch the bread. Touch the bread. Here you go, stream. A nice hot bowl of Hungarian goulash, traditionally made in sour cream on top. Oh, that looks really good. For Mrs. Brumbar, with that. Mm. It looks really Get more good. juice. There's so much liquid in there. I was scooping. Scoop hotter. Oh, God, I just smelled the mushrooms, and they smell incredible, too. I'm trying to figure out if there's a better chain of events I could have done, but I don't think there could have been. If I probably, if I hadn't taken so long doing the, getting the bread ready, I think we'd have a better time in terms of, like, getting the shit delivered on time. But, um, I don't give a fuck. I'm going to eat those mushrooms regardless. Good. Fucking better be. I, I thought you tilted it too far for camera. No. I just poured it out. I don't see how in the fuck this is serving mm. for four people. I mean, if you're trying to feed four dudes on the front, maybe. Got to put put out another bowl for the third homies. Got a bowl for the third. It says hell yeah, hummy, <laughs> yummy, yummy. Uh, Galloway says you can see really see the improvement in quality every stream, and uh, JD wants a spork. Oh, spork. <laughs> yeah, JD, JD, I I'm gonna move. Why? 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 That's still hot, Brandon. Why would you touch that? <laughs> There's difficulties with hot things in this. I'm gonna put banana bread on a cooling rack. Up there, out of the way. So when the mushrooms come out, we can put those up there. Ah. That looks so good. I don't want to stick my face in it. Um. All right, we have 15 minutes left. Yep. Let's uh, let's see you take a bite. I'm gonna put a little. I'll put a little dollop. I'll put a little dollop. It is, it is quite warm. <laughs> <laughs> it is very tasty though. I put a little bit of pepper on top. It's quite good. Mix my sour cream in. Very tasty. I like the. Uh, the beef's actually really good. Yeah, the, um, the broth is really tasty on it too. Yeah, is it a chicken stock broth or it's a beef, beef. beef stock? Yeah. Um, I bought this company's. They make chicken and beef, but it's like no uh, kettle and fire. Uh, super low calorie. They don't like it's not super 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 salty. Where do you um, get? The, is it a Publix? Publix. Yeah. I I don't know why I shop only at Publix. I do the same thing. I, that and Publix is like the most expensive grocery store. But I've never had a problem with the quality of stuff I get from Publix. Because I used to shop for groceries from Walmart when I lived in Athens. And it was a fucking crapshoot trying to get good anything from there. So. All right. All right. Fox says, hmm, I'm inspired to cook now. And JD says, uh, bam, successful stream then. All right. Bowl's really fucking hot. So I'm just not going to carry the bowl. Don't burn me. Gonna burn. It's going to burn me. Oh. There's your channel emote. That looks good. <laughs> yeah. Hang on, hang on. Let me get rid of the uh, the chat overlay on there. There we go. That's an emote right there. Give her a little kissy. A little smirk. Kiss it like you're kissing your sister. Kiss it like you're kissing your sister. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Salute, boys. It's good. You killed it. 
Yeah. Fuck, that's good. Now I gotta bring some to my dad. <laughs> no, like, okay. So we're gonna we're gonna get roll talk for a little bit while we wait on the mushrooms. Um, my dad is deeply Hungarian. Uh, his pretty much his entire extended family is Hungarian. Um, his whole family were butchers, farmers like cattle farmers and butchers. So when he was at like when he had his first job at a car dealership, his aunt would show up, and she would bring like entire picnic baskets or whatever you want to call it of food and she'd come in in the traditional she's got the wrap around her face she's got the the sorry the apron on the frilly little shit on the end and she'd come calling in with her babushka hair built up just and she would bring them just pounds of food uh fat bread which is you roast meat over a fire, and as it's dripping down, you hold bread up underneath it so it soaks up grease and flavor, and it crisps. Um, goulash is one of my favorite foods because it all it just makes me think of my dad, and I love my dad. Um, but yeah, uh, you guys asked me to make borscht. I don't know how to make borscht, so I made goulash instead, uh, which is, as I said, a very, very big comfort food for me. It's very tasty. It, you can taste the paprika, but it's not like... It's not overpowering. I know everyone was worried about the paprika in there, but it's... Well, it, as long as you don't it, burn it, it doesn't get bitter, so it kind of melds into it. Mm -hmm. More than anything, you taste it. I, like, I taste bay leaf throughout. I don't know if it's... Huh, I don't taste that it, not very much. I don't know if it's like maybe I taste it more than other things. But like more than anything, you just taste... The roasted onions, the butter... The beef comes through very subtly. It's not like punch in the face. It's stewing beef, so it's not really fatty. But it's so good, though. Mm -hmm. The potatoes are perfectly soft. They melt in your mouth. Carrots are great. The peppers have like no rigidity them to them. Rigidity to them anymore. They impart a little bit of that like bell pepper sweetness to them. It's so good. It's very tasty. It's enough out of you, Sink. <laughs> Ooh, so, that'll feed. We got leftover pizza in there. We got this. I got leftover... Um, do you still have pizza left? <laughs> yeah. Oh, my gosh. Oh, do you know just the kids on the blind pizza? Yeah. Did you do that? So that one is not technically Hawaiian. It's jalapeno, pineapple, onion, ham, and bacon. So I told them to hold the ham because I don't really like ham. I thought the onions would still be fine. Was it a little weird? I got you. All right, I'll remember that for the future. I can remember what, what you like from uh, Mellow Mushroom. I love Mellow Mushroom pizza, though. It's so I, My only problem with them is they leave so much room for crust, and their crust is so fucking chewy. But you get a ranch on the side, and it's a perfect vehicle. It's like a breadstick at the end. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> oh, but It I rewards would... you. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention when I ordered, so I got, I got pizza so we could have leftovers. Mm -hmm. I got a the barbecue or the buffalo chicken pizza for me. I got her the demented Hawaiian, yeah. and then I got a cheesy bread because it's fucking cheesy bread. Mm -hmm. But there was an option for red sauce. I was like, oh, okay, extra red sauce on the side. I like to dip cheesy bread in red sauce. No, mm -hmm. these motherfuckers made a French bread pizza. So it was the front. It was the baguette garlic and then just a thick layer of sauce and then the cheese on they just made me a french bread pizza so i had pizza as an appetizer to my pizza <laughs> and you know what it was fucking delicious <laughs> that is funny come on you fucking mushroom did i put another timer on that did you okay google how much time is left it looks like you don't have any alarms shut up Oh no. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> uh, Frox says, uh, sounds like a win, honestly. Uh, Grayson says, pizza There's on a puddle baguette. of mushroom juice in there. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Grayson says, pizza on a baguette just activated my fight or flight. Although I don't get okay, it. It's, it's not bread. like a thin baguette. It's like, it's like the big, thick baguette. Like, it's like 
when you were a kid in elementary school, French bread pizza. You didn't like French bread? I love French bread pizza. It was. It's a weird. It's a weird combination. Um, back when I was young, back in the day, in the nineties, our school would do fundraisers. You remember these where you had to sell pizza kits? Mm -hmm. It was the shittiest pizza known to man, too. Like the bread, it, it came in a bread, sauce, and cheese, but they were all rock solid. So if you wanted pizza, you had to thaw them four days in advance. Yeah. Galloway, it's good seeing you. He says he's got to go to sleep now. Night, night. Where the fuck you got to go, boy? That was aggressive. I'm sorry. Galloway, it's good seeing you. Thanks for joining us. Thanks, Galloway. I'm not an asshole. I promise. Just so happy with this fucking go. I don't give a shit about what happens now. I don't yeah, care I'm if those mushrooms some, uh, are fucking funky as fuck. I'm that is have some extra so good. If you want to, we can get some stuff without beef in it if you want to take some of the Meg. But I don't know. What do you think with the beef stock mess with her, you think? Uh, with the beef stock, yeah. It's okay. You can take her some mushrooms. Jasper, sure you can. want a mushroom? I think she'd like that. I'm going to let them roast a little bit so not to look what it is. Liquidius. Liquidius Jr. <laughs> Liquidius Jr. <laughs> and to be fair, I only ever promise a, an entree in something. This is the first time I've done three, so I'm just glad they came out. That's good. You timed it I well. didn't fuck up three of them. A lot of the, the restaurant business is just timing when to do stuff in order to get oh, an yeah. order out. Yeah. I don't... The idea of ever being a chef in a in a restaurant kitchen makes my head hurt because they do so much shit um uh, oh galloway sent me the map let's talk to some people real quick come on <laughs> oh no <laughs> uh also grayson wants to know if you have a plan for next uh, stream uh, well, next stream is probably not going to be from for a while. Right, I'm going to be out of town. He said next cooking stream, I guess. I don't know. Uh, we have some time to plan. So if I need to get anything special, special, I can. You guys keep asking for ice cream, but ice cream takes hours to make is the problem. You'd have to like make it in advance in like two batches. You well, the beginning and the end. some of them, I think if you, you only put them in the thing, the thing for like an hour and a half. Mm -hmm. So if I got a thing going instantly, I might be able to get it done in time. I know JD wants a completely peach dedicated stream, so I'd have to look up some entrees that required peach. Yeah, Grayson says, I want to see you make something hella difficult. Fuck you, Grayson. So there you go. Ice cream. Um, all right. So Grayson's in the United States. That's good. Where is his name at? Fox says, uh, thought ice cream was made for the Arctic cows. From the Arctic cows. Grayson says, I enjoy the suffering of others. Uh, All right, where the Jack says, uh, how about a British favorite, fish and chips, and a homemade mushy peas? Dude, I know where Grayson is. Oh, no. <laughs> Grayson's actually not that far away. If we went if we went and visited Bright, we'd be well, like within 30 minutes of Grayson. So maybe next time we go see Bright, we can invite Grayson to come over. Uh, yeah, I, I see it. No, I, they don't know where Bright lives. Um, but yeah, Grayson, next time I'm up there in that area, I'll make sure to let you know. And maybe we'll, uh, do the stream. Do something. I don't want to carry my Grayson. fucking computer up there, but I'll definitely hang out and get some pics. Bring a laptop. That fat dick. Um, what? What, Elise? What? You're Grayson says, not that far. It's like a nine hour drive. Hell yeah. Brother, my extended family lives 10 hours away. A nine hour drive is not that hard. Yeah, driving a pick. Okay, so I flew to Texas, stayed for three days, and then crammed into her tiny fucking Ford Taurus with a cat. Fifteen. Fifteen, 15 hours. Dang. We left at... Yeah, when you visited your family in Wyoming. <laughs> or what? Yeah, Wisconsin. That's 15 hours, like, just one way. Yeah. yeah so so for 15 hours, we were in that fucking Ford Taurus. I've never hated oh, Ford Taurus so much in my life. Jasper sat in my... Do you still have a picture of Jasper sitting in my lap? Please, Elise will post this. There's a pet in the pet appreciation zone, please. Jasper sits in my lap while we're driving down the road and just looks up at me lovingly, and he's never done that since. He hates me. <laughs> Anyways, sorry, you were reading. Uh, Grayson says, it's okay. You don't need to do a cooking stream when you visit. You're already bringing cake. 
<laughs> I don't know if these are done yet. I'll give them another minute. God, I want to eat this banana bread so yeah, fucking looks badly, really good. dude. Jesus Christ. I got to eat my soup. The problem with the, the stream is I get so, like, amped up and nervous, I don't really eat. Mm-hmm. It's just you standing in your kitchen right now. No, no, I'm right. sorry. No, we're just talking. Yeah. No, we don't get to talk. Uh, 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 pepper skin. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, pepper skin on the floor. Drop like 12 things this fucking stream. Man. Uh, I know exactly. If we, I've... <laughs> My mom's ever on here. I know exactly what she wants to cook. She makes these um, white chicken enchilada bake thing it's like cream chicken enchiladas it's like white people enchiladas but it's so good we get invite uh, elisa's best friend on and um let her hate us forever because we could do the hibachi stream that day and really piss keys off i'm excited for that stream i i like the idea I'm, if we do that, the steaks most likely either I'll do on the grill or I'm going to do on a skillet. Mm -hmm. Because on that grill downstairs, either it doesn't get hot enough or like the liquid from everything else gets stuck on the steaks and they don't brown properly and it drives me fucking nuts. So most likely I just grill them. <laughs> but yeah, hibachi stream is actually really easy. It doesn't take that long is the problem. So it'd mm -hmm. be a fast stream. But then again, I do, if I do hibachi stream, you're like, mama, make sushi. Mama. And I'm, I'm not. I no, hate sushi. Making sushi at home is not something I'm interested in. Well, you get those like, have you seen those sushi pullers? So it's no, like a little plastic device with a plunger in it, and you put rice and everything in it, and you shut it, and then you just <laughs> and shit out a sushi <laughs> roll. Um. So JD says, when are you going to flip the script on Nelson and have him cook? And Nelson then... needs to do Dragon's Edge. That is, yeah, that is a stream in the future. You I are think doing for July Fourth. Yeah, I'll be, uh, I'll be working on those. You are doing dragon's eggs, because those things are so fucking good, but I cannot cook them to save my life. Um, and then Grayson says, honestly, just have uh, a stream of Nilsson making a ton of mixed drinks with Brumbar reading chat and getting super drunk. And uh, Jack okay says, hell yeah, drunk cooking, best cooking. And then JD says, oh yeah, the Nilsson bar segment was good last time. I appreciate that, JD. Thank you. We could do some... We could do we could do a good I don't know if we could do three hours of mixed drinks. That's a lot of mixed drinks. Ooh, but we could do drinking games. So make drinks, play a game with a drinking game. And robots. Uh, we could also play bang. You take a shot every time you get shot. Mm. Yeah, every time you get a bang. <laughs> We're five drinks in. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna pull these fuckers up. Um, get ready. Is that camera on? Is close camera? <laughs> It's on uh, picture, picture right now. All right, cool. Here are some delicious, crispy, crispy mushrooms stuffed with cream cheese and mushroom. I've browned the Parmesan around them. They smell incredible. But that is your stream for the evening, ladies and gentlemen. I, uh, I, I probably shouldn't cut into this yet. How long has it been? Um, probably. It says let cool for 20 minutes. It's definitely been 20 minutes. Let me see if I can get it out of there. Using my perfectly executed parchment paper. <laughs> Grace says, the way Brembar's head shot up when he heard my plan included him getting super drunk. 10 out of 10. Yeah, I want to call booze. Booze is easy. I don't have to do anything. So... I'm excited. Yeah, I want to do some dragon's eggs. Those actually require some, some prep and. This is still very moist. Oh my god! There's a giant thing of chocolate on my finger. I... But there's your banana bread. Is that paper or chocolate? That's chocolate. Mm. <laughs> that sounds great. But God, get in close. They're getting in that that close shot there. Hang on, hang on. Oops. And there's your banana <laughs> you bread. See the two of us like fucking around with it. Oh, full oh. screen. Oh god, full screen. Can you see my erection on the background? <laughs> uh, see, do you want a mushroom? 
Grayson Big says, one or little one? Uh, big one or little one? Grayson says, well, Brumbar, if you want to do something with alcohol, Bombay something. Here's, here's a close-up of the mushroom, boys. Crispy top, very soft underbelly because it's been cooked. Oh, boiled. Maybe when we're working outside, we could uh, flambe something on the grill. I'll do that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Fuck them. Mm -hmm. Those are a great appetizer. Too bad I'm eating them after everything. <laughs> I love the picture in picture of the banana bread. It's... No one gives a sh no one's watching me right now. They're just sitting there watching that banana bread. All right, we're going full frame. Ooh. Uh, you just looking more at the banana bread. <laughs> it's just full frame banana Nothing's bread. Nothing's just right vibing. <laughs> uh, you want another? Uh, here's one. Nothing. Do you want to try one? Uh, I will here in a minute. Okay, I think that'll be good. They look really good though. My goulash. The goulash is so good. Excellent. The spice inside I'm of the broth. I'm keeping that one. I'm keeping that recipe. It's really easy. Yeah. Just prep. It's actually really cheap, too. Beef's like $9 for a pound and a half. But that's like the stew beef. Yeah. It's not super expensive. It's supposed to be cheap beef because you don't really stew expensive beef because it, it, no matter what, it all turns into the same thing. <laughs> Most expensive part is the fucking paprika. Oh, also, shout out. Yeah, let's see it. This stream is brought to you by... Not really. Not a sponsor. Try the Zegit. Hungarian paprika. Delicious. Give me a full frame of that. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Perfect. Kind of. Perfect. There you go. <laughs> Fat lips coming in from fucking stage left or stage right. Is it stage right looking at the stage or is it looking in the audience? Lisey, do you know? Uh, stage We're right at Harper is, at. Stage right is your left. Right now. Yeah, that's right. So it's, it's stage looking right at the audience. Yeah. It's the stage is right as the audience. Yes. No, no, because I'm looking. I'm on the stage right now. So it's it, stage it, left, it's my from left. From the audience. From the audience? And then it's, so it's my right, your left. Yeah. Okay. Where's Harper at? We need Harper. We've gone over time. Yeah, we're at three hours and ten minutes. Well, I'm enjoying my soup. Oh, wait. I gotta do the meme. Gotta do the meme. No, so be ready. Ready. Good soup. <laughs> I love Adam Driver. Excellent. I still just have a picture in picture of banana bread down there. It's looking good. It's looking real good. You guys don't. We're gonna have to turn the stream off before Nilsson gets his hands on this banana bread and does some unholy shit to it. Go full frame on it. There we go. Something wrong with you. Mm -hmm. All right. You ready? Ready. All right. Off the banana bread. On me, please. Mm -hmm. I am the star. All right, boys. We're winding down. As always, I really appreciate you showing up, commenting, talking, fun hanging out with you. Um, as always, to anybody in the unit, you ever come through this area, let us know. We're very happy to grab lunch. Um, people are always happy. You can volunteer to be a chef on the stream. But if I only know you for like an hour, it's not going to happen. I got to know you and trust you. Be in my house. But like I said, appreciate you being here. Today's food was fantastic. Brought up some great memories. Nilsson's going to fuck that banana bread. Oh, God. Oh, no. um, I'll let you guys know when the next one is. Two weeks from now, I think. Lisa, can you check the calendar real quick? Is two weeks into our vacation? Uh, it might be three weeks. So I, we may get another one. What's two weeks from today? Uh, yeah, that's two weeks. This, the Vic. Yeah, so we'll be on. So, um, 
I'll most likely I'll share a bunch of pictures. I'm going to bring the Canon with us, take some nice pictures. Um, but there will not be a stream for probably four weeks, three, four weeks. Because we're leaving two weeks from now. We're getting back three weeks from now. So we'll do a stream in four weeks. That's fine. And uh, let me know if there's anything big you want. We're getting into grilling season. Um, I could always do like a meal prep. Okay. We do like That'd a big cool. meal and separate mm -hmm. it out. Um, yeah, I'm going to keep saying the same shit. I, I really appreciate it. It means a lot to me that you guys show up. Um, you don't have to, um, I really, no, you don't. I'm not going to kick you out of the unit. Um, have a good night. Be safe more than anything without shit. Everything's going nowadays, but, uh, no, I like getting sentimental at the end. I've had enough to drink. Um, cook something. Cook something that makes you happy. I like cooking for my friends, and that's why you're here. No, shut up. You're not a director. Have a good night, guys.